going on everybody act 8.2 almost done man got two quests left so let's get a tweet out and get to work here dearest dad marvel champions uh, only two quests remain uh in the 100 per centing <laughs> is that a can i can i yeah, screw it. What in the one hundred percenting of Act Eight Point Two? Uh, let's take that down to one. Uh, yes. No. Ah. Okay. You know what? I like spelling it out. All right. Only two guys remain in the one hundred percenting of Act Eight Point Two. Let's take that down to one. Two. Eight. All right. What's up, people? Um, let's get started here. Uh, Abby Doe will be joining on call uh, once again pretty soon here. But uh, in the meantime, we can get started on the first path here. So let's take a little a little look. See here. See what we got for path number one. Maybe peruse the map just a little bit. See where we're starting out. Mm -hmm, mm hmm okay um let's see how's this map looking uh, okay okay looking uh fairly standard how many fights on a path <gasps> is that six and are there six paths and then three bosses no way all right uh i think i'm just gonna go left and then once again kind of loop around counterclockwise style so uh yeah Let's go ahead and do that, which means this CGR is path number one. So, siphoning strength each time a mystic attacker inflicts a power drain, power burn, or steal on the defender, gain an indefinite uh, fury passive, increasing attack rating by 35%. Uh, okay, well, that's a lot of attack, so probably should take advantage of that. Power armor two, whenever either champion gains a bar of power, the defender gains an armor up buff, increasing armor by 10% for 10 seconds. Um, okay, I mean, that's cool because, yeah, that's just more buffs to to eliminate for mystic dispersion and all that. Uh, occult equilibrium, each time a mystic attacker gains a regeneration effect, power drain 10% of the defender's max power. Okay, really wish I had... Um, my uh what's it called my rintra ranked up but that's okay uh and then armored assaults while the defender has an armor up buff active yeah they gain attack and become block all right so arm break immunity as well okay cool okay so mostly mystics then yeah and it's looking like a pretty mystical mystic -able path the only problem that i I'm seeing is this Colossus right here. You can't get rid of his armor ups. Wait, no, you still can get rid of his armor ups. You just can't armor break him unless you're tech, right? Um, so yeah, we can. I think we can still get rid of those. Pretty sure it's just armor break that he has a problem with. Okay, well, let's throw some mystics on the team. Uh, by the way, what's up, everybody? Sorry, I'm kind of ignoring uh, you guys here today, but. Uh, Clarissa, of course, as usual, saying no. Uh, hey, bowling bald man, what's up? You're gonna try to finish Act Six while you're doing Act Eight. I just got cap two days ago. Okay, um, that's that's a that's a lofty goal for just getting cav. Uh, but I like it. I like it. Make the push. July Fourth is coming around. I'm not sure if you're gonna be uh, looking to get any of the offers for for July Fourth, but it would be a good time to try to push through Act Six. Um, make your way through there, get Throne Breaker, all that. PG, do you rank for your Kingpin yet? Uh, what, boss? Did you rank for your Kingpin yet in not do so? Oh, if not do so? Uh, no, I did not. Not yet. 7 a.m. here in Australia. I haven't slammed because I'm finishing 8.2. Okay. All right. It looks like we got a few people in here, uh, doing some, uh, Doing some story questing, so that's cool, man. We could uh, we can quest on through together. Let's do it. Let's let, let's hold hands, and uh, you guys look left, I'll look right, and uh, we'll get through this. Uh, all right, Miro Watang. Oh, oh, hold on, hold on. 
Mero Watang. <laughs> Stop. Mero Watang with the two. With the two pounds. Thank you very much, dude. I almost did a, uh, instead of slap a Watang slap. Uh, maybe I should have. <laughs> you get your own special one uh, for having the coolest name. Uh, thank you very much for the two pounds. Uh, much appreciated. Oh, Flashy. Oh, you guys were oh, this close to a double on Flashy. I'm so sorry. Uh, but Flashy, thank you for the 13 MXs. Um, just saying. Oh, I actually already read your message before realizing the super chat. You were uh, going through 8.2 as well on no sleep. Uh, <laughs> not me missing the slap for the fifth time. Oh, brutal. Just did the intercept path on this quest? I liked the difficulty. Okay, the intercept path. Well, I guess I'll be getting to that soon enough. Um, let me go ahead and uh, actually get some champs on the team here so that I can begin. The I would actually love this path if it weren't for me running the recoil masteries. That's the issue. Uh, so I'm, I'm probably going to have to have Fury Gold Pool on the team just to keep some of my champs um, around for more than one fight. Uh, but yeah, kind of, kind of sucks. I'm um, definitely going to put these guys on the team together. I'd really like to put Sorcerer on the team. She needs to throw special ones though, you guys. Special freaking ones. Um, still do it, I guess. Um... Armor up buff. It's only one armor up buff every like 10 seconds, right? So this isn't a... I don't think this is a Ronin cheese kind of path, is it? Maybe it is. I wonder if that like Colossus, because Colossus gains the armor ups and stuff. I bet you could uh, Ronin stunlock that guy. Um, I would I, I would think you would be able to do that. Uh, I'm trying to think if I should maybe like Dragon Man, because Dragon Man I could mostly special three, but... Do I really get the bonuses with that guy? Oh, man, Claire. Oh, dude, maybe I should even put my five-star Claire in here. Uh, it kind of makes me sad. <laughs> um, dang, dude. Claire would be very sustainable. Oh, maybe I do that. Uh, really, really would be sad to uh, take out, like, my rank four Sorcerer Supreme to put it a five-star Claire. Uh, Alex, thank you very much for the five cent. I finished eight point two. It was fun. Also hung over from a big party last night. Thanks to the stream, BG long time fan. Oh, Alex, uh, hydrate well, my friend. <laughs> uh, good luck with that hangover. Uh, that's awesome though, dude. Getting uh, uh, finished up uh, eight point two. Nice man. Very very nice. And yeah, dude. Thank you very much for the five of the kind words. Appreciate it, dude. Thank you very much. Brian Grant of the New Jersey Grants, we meet again. You call or me? Uh, I'll. I guess I'll call you. Uh, let me get Abby Doe on the call here. Mm -mm -mm. Here we go. Calling now. Is that BG and Future Abdo? Oh well, the future is about to be here right now. I think. Are we on call? I, I don't. Uh, oh yeah. Well, uh, what? What? There he is. Hey, what's up, dude? <laughs> How's it going? And the mic sounds good today. Sounds like it's picking up the right mic, so that's good. I I tried to yeah, I've been I've been trying to make sure I have Discord actually open before calling. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, that'll do it. Uh, um, <laughs> man, I'm just trying to decide if I want to bring in like Diablo and Claire over some of my other ranked up mystics just because of stupid recoils. Which path um, are we doing? Uh, it's like mystics gain a whole bunch of benefits. You know the drill. Yeah. Right. Um. Uh, uh, screw it. I'm gonna I'm gonna run with this team. Uh, I don't care. I'll probably have to use some resources as a result. May or maybe I should do this. Maybe I should put. Maybe I should. Hmm. No, let's just go. Let's go. Okay. Let's go. Gilly is a cheese option. Uh, was it one of those paths? I don't know. I don't remember. Of course. Uh, what's up, chat? How's everybody doing today? Oh, look at this. Abby Dingus. The game is telling me how to use strikers. Oh, okay. Thank you. I definitely <laughs> wasn't just using strikers all day yesterday. 
Thanks for letting me know. Abby Dingus sounds like he just woke up. I, I slept until about like 11, I think, this morning. Easy. So I've been, been awake for like three hours. I'm still a little congested, though. I'm freaked. Like cold. Come on. You've done your job. Go away. I think it's maybe the virus is mad that I stayed in and didn't infect anybody else. And it's just hanging on for dear life. Like, come on, man. Just infect one other person. Like, no, sorry, buddy. Mm. Can't happen. Yeah. All right. Let's, mm. let's start it with Sorcerer. I want to I want to see just how much damage I will take here. Because uh, maybe that will make me change my mind about the team that I'm running. Yeah, um, it's worth it. Dang, already unstoppable, huh? Oh, I, I, I started in the wrong mode. Whoops, that's all right. BG, are we reading Twitter today? Uh, Jay Soup probably kind of going to keep it to a minimum for Twitter. Um, not that I'm suggesting you you do this, but probably probably just mostly keep it to uh, like somebody's super chats and do tweeters on another day, like on an arena or battleground stream, I would imagine, just to get through this kind of stuff. Uh, yeah, kind of, pretty much that. It's it's kind of impossible to go through these fights uh, while reading Twitter is the thing. So yeah, just for speed. Yep. Yeah, no. What's up, White Mummy? How you doing, White Mummy? The best. Hope you had a good time over at your folks. Awesome, Schlerm, Chris Gonzalez, Pixie. How are you guys all doing? Dugweed, Steve K2000, what's up, dude? This guy, MCOC fan, Macho Man's dad. What's up, Macho Man's dad? You look like you are the dementia dreaming with a beard picture. I can't tell, but okay. <laughs> I just realized uh, if if they're armor break immune, I still won't be dealing that much damage with Source for Supreme. So yeah, that's unfortunate. Okay, I'm happy I used her in the first fight, but uh, to find that out, yeah. I did, I did forget that her damage comes through armor breaks, so um, RIP to that one. Let's uh, restart Claire and Doom. Um, yeah, Claire or I Diablo. Mean, Claire or, uh, Diablo, rather, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's up, Edwin? What's up, Mob Omega? How you doing today? And which do I put in here? Uh Did you BG, I know you said limited Twitter, but this one is very important because of today. This is from White Mummy. I'm guessing he might have some kind of Father's Day creation. Shout out to all the fathers out there. Way to have a weak pullout game. All right, we'll, we'll, we'll take a, a little gander here. Let's see. Uh, oh, look at this. Uh, I saw that the, uh, the MCOCs posted this. Dang, dude. So good the way you're able to do that. Look at that. Sick, dude. Very nice, as always. Uh, oh, right. there we go. Let's see. I... I... Don't know who I should put in. I'm, I'm thinking Diablo will be faster. Maybe. So, With recoils, maybe. Maybe I'll do that. Honestly, maybe at this... Uh, do I just take out gold pool? If I have, if I throw in a couple champs that are sustainable, it's tempting. Now, screw it. Let's just go with this. All right, we start again. Talking about pullout game, not exactly family friendly. Well, easy. If you're a kid and you're listening, and that doesn't go over your head, then you're old enough to get that joke. That's fine. I take it back. Also, actually, I'm going Claire. <laughs> <laughs> Diablo faster, Claire easier. We shall see. Yeah. Okay. All right. Now we go. <laughs> I do not have a six-star Diablo. Oh, oh, excuse me. I didn't know I was supposed to have every freaking <laughs> champ. I do have a six-star Diablo, actually. Um, it's not awakened. I think it... Uh, let me see. I think it... I can't remember if it's unawakened or, or just SIG 20 at the moment. Uh, I do not recall, but, um, I didn't have SIGs for, for the longest, and now that I do have SIGs, I'm, like, getting other champs, uh, together, so, yeah, yeah that's I really how that enjoyed happens. Diablo, and have been, I used him for auto farming, and that kind of stuff, and just was using him quite a lot back in the day, however, uh, it uh they just I haven't I haven't ranked him past rank three for some reason, so I just like found like a lot of other more impressive champions, I think, overall. 
Mm. Let the bad seat gaming begin. Oh yeah, you know it. What's up, Emma? How's it going? Chimera. J Soup, the best way of getting gold. Do arenas, sadly. Go ahead and, and rock those arenas. Uh, the incursions also have a decent amount of gold in them. And, you know, there's always the spending route, which I don't recommend, but you can do. Uh, gets you gold for, like, the sigils. Pretty good offer, kind of, gold-wise. But there's, there's lots of ways to get gold. More champions you uh, dupe and... Uh, collect like that the more ISO you're gonna get which is good for ranking those champions up but sometimes you'll have extra ISO and you can sell that for gold as well so you get all that stuff from the arena that's the way to go use the bleed curse well he's gonna go for damage too so the he's both incinerate and bleed immune so get more damage out of the incinerate one then try and finish up with a uh, bleed to get a little bit of health back but should be fine either way yeah, I just cycled around. Uh, I just was getting the poison yeah. off and stuff. Yep. Yeah. Oh, 10 Furies, not bad. <clears throat> yeah, that's where they cap out at. But uh, that's not too bad for a 5 star, minute 40 for the fight. Okay. No, no. We're on it. Hey, BG, are you going to do Battlegrounds tonight? I, I don't think he's streaming again tonight, Jordan. No, no, this is the. Uh, this is the stream for today. What's up, MSD? Oh, How you doing? Happy nah, Father's Day, man. MCOC dad, he says. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Well, I was a father at uh, Comic-Con, so yeah, I guess so. <laughs> yeah, you got to get your boy, sneak him in. <laughs> uh, Abdo, should I do the EQ Uncollected or finish Act 5? Well, Act 5 will always be there, so I would go with the uh, temporary content, get those rewards. Yeah, what, uh, what's going on though today, guys? You guys doing anything exciting with your dads? I might, uh, after this is done, go get some dinner with my dad, possibly before I stream later on in the evening. Not sure. Yeah, okay. We've never been, we always just, dad and, I mean, you know, dads get forgotten a lot more than moms as far as this, this kind of holidays go. But the, uh, we, we've always just, made a joke of it and been like, we don't care about Hallmark holidays anyways, because I love you every day of the year, you know? So I'd always make sure to call my mom <laughs> like a couple days before Mother's Day and be like, hey, what's up? You know, I love you. That day's stupid. And then occasionally I'd have my buddy who is still living in our hometown just go take her flowers on Mother's Day anyways and stuff. So mm -hmm. good times. But yeah, for, for Father's Day, I'm like, yeah, my dad doesn't care. <laughs> My my dad my dad was like, uh, yeah, maybe we can go out to dinner later, and I can treat myself to dinner. Uh, you too. <laughs> <laughs> like a, like okay, sounds good. Oxygen sending over what are we? The Swiss francs, francs. Uh, oxygen, five of them. Thank you, oxygen. Saying after the Paragon event, I had a lot of ISO, and yesterday I had to sell three thousand plus before expiring. First time with thirty-seven million gold. Yeah, dude. Yeah, similar experience. Okay, I don't know if uh, Absorbing Man's the best for this path or if I just wasn't playing him right and stuff. Um, but I, I don't know that I can... Is there a way for me to get the, the Furies with him? I had like Furies? one because of the... I mean, it, I, it's it's from healing too, so... But I needed, what, 150 charges before I could activate the heal? Yeah, I believe so. Abs man needs a buff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's, oxygen. That's great yeah. though. That uh, that's awesome. I, I'm not sure. Did he reread the note or? I read it, but I mean, come on. I, I, <laughs> I just use Claire and go faster. I guess. I'm gonna try. Do I mean it wasn't that horrible of a fight or anything, but I'm gonna use. Doom here. We'll see how that one goes. My dad passed away in 2016, so appreciate your dad's while you have him. That is true. Sorry to hear that, man, but uh, it does. It gets a little easier. I was talking to my dad this morning, or just texting with him about, you know, when I was going to be on with Brian, so do dinner maybe instead of lunch. And uh, <laughs> we both, yeah, like, you know. You know, my mom just passed away and just, I, I was like, yep, I just was having a dream about her last night. My dad was like, yep, I was too. Like, yeah, it gets easier, but do appreciate your loved ones when you got them. 
around. Unless they suck, then then don't worry about it. <laughs> um, BG has no info. BG has no info regarding new account challenge. He knows that he will do one, and will tell us what he decides to. Yep, Chris, that's pretty much got it down. <laughs> yeah. I'm thinking of. So I broke down, and for the first time since the revive nerf thing, I I purchased the sigil. Because uh, I'm thinking I'm I'm kind of tempted to go for Danny tomorrow, at least okay. start it off and see. I haven't done a grind in forever, and it doesn't sound like it would be that much fun. But I am kind of curious as to what I could put up these days with my my roster. And she went around a hundred mil ish, so that's not too bad. Yeah, it's not too bad. You MD probably might be able to do that pretty easy. Yeah. MD might help for this path. Yeah, Agent Carmichael, but I don't think he wants to reset his uh, masteries just for one path. How you doing today, though? Oh, my God. Do I not have it? Because I was thinking, like, is MD not working? I don't have it on. Oh, my God. I keep forgetting <laughs> that uh, I don't have it on. That's so annoying. Yeah, because that's the whole thing. The whole time I'm thinking, oh, whoa. Okay, Elgato, uh, let's try unplugging you and plugging you back in. I have a fresh cable here, so it, uh, I need the cable on this one. Oh, my, please, my, lightning oh, thing, my lightning thing works really well most of the time, and then sometimes it's just like, what are you, what are you doing? Do I need to replace you? Do I not? Doom Buggy yeah. 23 sending over $2 saying, Sup, BG and Human Torch Trapper. Thank you so much, Doom Buggy, for reminding me. It won't be fun. She'll go a lot higher in round two. You're going for her easy. I mean, yeah, that's what, I, that's what I'm saying. Like, could be fun. Well, is grinding arena straight for three days ever fun, really? <laughs> but, but if I do that, then I will do multiple streams. And, uh, you know, that'll be fun at least, so. I mean, I it's it fun just... getting new champs. Arena, yeah, it sucks, but, like, I don't know. It's still pretty cool yeah. getting a uh, new champ and, like, the way you get it. Um, that's, that's why I play games. It's like, you, you have control over and you're, like, you know, doing something to earn it fun yeah i i, I want to test out the the express mode go a little faster and uh i i don't know we'll we'll see but i, I think I'm, i can i can go for it i can probably pretty easily put up 120 something go a little higher than that what's up messiah what's up lizer lizer saying she loves the day streams well the day streams i'm sure love you lizer Yo, uh, Messiah Lizer, what's going on? Messiah Lizer. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, we did read, I heard you read uh, June Buggy, which, by the way, thank you. Uh, did you read Oxygen as well? Was I head down focused for that one? I must have been. Yeah, you were spacing out. I think that's when you were doing abs, man. And uh, yeah, wondering that makes why you sense. weren't getting more. <laughs> that yeah. makes sense. I'm gonna read again just because I I was totally uh, <laughs> paying attention to the game at that point. Oxygen, thank you uh, for the five CHF. You had said um, after the Paragon event, had a lot of ISO in yesterday. I had to sell three thousand plus before expiring. First time with thirty seven million gold. Dang dude, three thousand plus. Yeah, I those Paragon crystals, man. As uh, as expected, they they deliver on the ISO. Which is a little worrisome because now I'm, I'm afraid that uh, Bam's like, oh, there's plenty of ice in the game. How do you get it? Well, get some Paragon crystals in you. You know, at least they're uh, 100 units cheaper than, than cats, so. Are they? Yeah, because they're 200 instead of 300, so. I thought that was just the featured. Uh, are, they, are, are the regular ones not that price, too? Um. I thought the regular cap crystals were, were 200. No, they're 300, aren't they? I don't know. I haven't bought one for so long. <laughs> well, that's the thing. Know. is like nobody buys a, a regular cap. Cavs are 175. Did they reduce the cost? Well, I think oh, they discounted okay. based on title or something like that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Interesting. 
Oh, T Pizzle sending over two dollars saying, "Love the early streams. Gotta go, but much love you too." See, if that was a pixie message, I would have expected to say "but munch" rather than "but much." But uh, yeah, love to you as well, T Pizzle. Have T a good Pizzle. day. Thank you, dude. Wow. I got, a, I got a Zoe dog over here whining at me, even though she just had a treat, even though she just went outside. Why, what are you, she's like, why are you talking to yourself this early in the day? Uh, Tom, what's up, Tom? How you doing? I don't know if I should read this message, but okay. Uh, Brian, my neighbor is currently upset with his wife for sunbathing naked. I'm personally on the fence. Uh, Tom. Boo, take a lap. Yeah, and not time. around your naked neighbor either. <laughs> Boo. Say happy Father's Day, Abdo, dang it. What, am I going to say it every five minutes, Messiah? <laughs> We've said it multiple times. <laughs> uh, shout out to all you mother fathers out there. As I'm sure, even if you're not an actual father, most everybody's a mother father. Looks like this path is um, really difficult if you have a Claire. Uh, <laughs> yeah, super tough. <laughs> I kind of forgot that um, I didn't even need to cycle around, so it's now it's super brain dead. Because, uh, yeah, starts out bleed immune, and then I've got Fury Gold Pool on the team for the poison. Yeah, so you don't really need to assess. Yeah, that, that. Yeah. Abdo forgot her birthday. Oh, she's a dog. She doesn't know when it's her birthday anyways, but yes, I technically did forget. <laughs> wow. You know, I wasn't really on Clarissa's side to, uh, you know, kidnap Zoe from you, but after hearing this, I don't know. Yeah, out of here. I mentioned that uh, if Pixie kidnapped her, she'd have to pay for the five or $6,000 surgery, so... Um, yeah, she very, qu true. very quickly she was like, uh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> <laughs> and she will, I will, uh, I will take her to the pet store. I would just, I could have done it in the last couple of days, but I'll, I'll, I'm going to take her in the car, even though she shouldn't really be sitting in the car that much. No, but, uh, I'm going to die. What'd you do? Okay. No, I was really hoping he wouldn't throw that special. Ah. Did you eat an L2 or something? Yeah, unblockable. I needed one more hit to get to a special. Oh, yeah. The unblockable gotcha. Um, Whoops. Dang, this, um, this... I spoke too soon, because this fight's actually going to be kind of annoying. Uh, I don't have the greatest of options with me without uh, Mystic Dispersion, at least. Um... But yeah, I, I'm gonna I'm gonna take Zoe into the pet store and get her. They have like a doggy ice cream or frozen yogurt or something. So I'm just mm. waiting for a couple days to take her. Tell some of her, some of the, some of the employees that love her the most will be there. I think they're there today. So depending, I might take her today or tomorrow. But they uh, we'll we'll take it in. I'll make a little I'll make a little short of Zoe getting her her ice cream or whatever. So. Okay. The only thing that sucks there is that there's music playing. So I'll have to probably get rid of that. In the background. Um, Messiah, what's up? You... I, I need help doing a video. I promised a vid when BG made me a mod so the world will see my face. Abdo needs some help as I have no clue what I'm doing. Well, there's this mode on your phone, Messiah, if you want, where you can, you know, flip the camera around mo most phones these days and you can just kind of record yourself. So, it's probably just do that. <laughs> Not, not technically, not there's a... Oh, God. There may even be a camera on the other side, too. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you could use a mirror. <laughs> I hate Green Goblin. Why did oh. you go unblockable again? No, you bastard. Mm. All right, really wiping out the whole team here. Hopefully there's a boss that uh, won't be too difficult. I mean, that's future Brian's problems. 
Green Goblin OP though, obviously. And the future is about to be here. I hate you both right now. I hope you know this. <laughs> well, I mean, like, besides, we can we can talk about it online or whatnot if you need some help with something. But you know, I'm not exactly the uh, best for technical stuff, anyways. But yeah. oh. I was. Did you I get him? Just, I almost just full dex his special one, which I don't know if I've ever done before. I don't think I ever have. Hey, BG and disembodied voice, what is your opinion on Jessica? Uh, I'm glad they added her to the game finally. That's my opinion on her. Uh, she's a pretty good defender if you don't have a good counter for her. I ban her pretty much every time I see her in Battlegrounds. I don't know how she is to play offensively, really. So. Uh, my opinion is, if I had a thousand bucks, I would, I'd give you my opinion because that's how you get her is uh, <laughs> by, by buying an entire catalog of uh, PS5 games <laughs> to to get that one character. Yeah, I did, I did not wail out for for her. All right, let me see here. So ah, oh, they put Penny. All right, well I'm only fighting this Penny once. Um. Maybe now is not the best time to fight her. Probably not bad. If I, I don't remember, but I mean, you got Hulkling, so Penny's never that bad with Hulkling, usually. Mm, that's true. Maybe I will end up fighting her more than once. Um, oof. All three of these are champs I don't really like fighting, so yeah, maybe it will end up being Penny. Let's, let's read a little here. Uh, backboard Brawler. While this defender is pinned against the wall, they gain a permanent passive fury. Okay. Um, uh, pumping iron, this defender takes 100% less damage while the defender has no buffs, yeah, yeah, foresight, so the intercept, and then mighty charge, actually, yeah, her nodes are pretty tame, I might fight her right now, swap out, uh, absorbing man for, uh, hulkling or something, um, I don't see, maybe even keep absorbing man on the team, I don't really need to shrug off, uh, the bleed with hulkling. Mm -hmm. Um, all right, for this one, stress test, whenever the attacker blocks a hit, pulls all buffs on the defender for two and a half seconds, whenever the attacker avoids a hit with dexterity or evade, inflict an atrophy bu debuff on the defender for two and a half seconds, uh, reducing the duration of any new buffs by 50%. Okay. Uh, vigorous assault, while the defender has a regen buff, they are unblockable, uh, buffet over time... Hit me, I dare you. When struck, the defender gains a chitin charge at 10. All charges are removed. The defender gains an armor up buff. Um, okay, and then Mystic Ascendancy. So, plus 40% base attack. Cosmic Chance. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. Okay. Um, do I want to fight this now? I could maybe... Um... I almost want to throw in Void and do this fight. Mm -hmm. I mean... With Void. Get it out the way? Kind of, yeah. Hmm. Well, wait. I'm not running... Let me see. Am I running Despair? 3 out of 3 Despair. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, now let me just do Hulkling first, I guess. I, I could always go back and, like, throw in Void or someone else for that other fight, so. Alright. Um. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Uh. You have Hulkling, he trivializes Penny Dingalingus. Is easy behind in the chat or am I? Uh. <laughs> I can't tell, because I feel like we were just talking about that, like, two minutes ago. But maybe, uh, maybe chat's moving a little slow since, uh, I'm, I'm focused on picking here. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anywho, let me, uh, yeah, let me fight this penny. Cersei is simple with the cow. Well, that's great, this guy, but Marion doesn't have the cow. Um, white mummy. Thank you very much. It looks, it's hard to see your eyes though in that one. I might need to get you a better picture. I don't know. 
Oh, your your work is excellent as usual, but like it does, it is pretty. I, mean, I don't know. Emotes are tough, man. Brian has the cow. Wait, does he? Let's ask Karate Mike. Where's Karate Mike? <laughs> no, I do have the cow. It's just that it's like rank one. So. Oh, gotcha. I have. I both have and do not have the cow. Thought he did. I'm sorry. No, apparently I was wrong. This guy. My my bad. Uh, I guess there's another bug with relics here. Is this a known issue where like, I certainly don't have a jugs attached to my Hulkling? <laughs> yeah, just a, a visual <laughs> issue there. Road news cow. Oh, it's Titan, by the way. Just for future reference. Pretty interesting. That um. Okay. Um, let's fight. <laughs> it's not a relic. He's just hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> he's just chilling, you know. <laughs> Invited himself to the party, I guess. It's fine. I didn't, you know, usually people don't complain about extra jugs at the party. It's true. I've heard uh, usually it's more of a complaint about hot dogs. Too many of them. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh It will look good in emoji size, but if you want me to make changes, let me know. White Mummy, yeah, maybe I need to like just upload it and see what it looks like. Uh, cause maybe, yeah, cause maybe it's cause it looks bigger, you know what I mean? For, in the email. Oh crud, I think I messed up here. Thank you, thank you, obviously though, dude. You're, you're the best. I done messed up, boys and girls. I'm just gonna <sighs> chill for a sec. Right, I guess I'll bait this too while I'm at it. Well, your name's Brian, not Aaron, so you're not supposed to be messing up. That's my job. Well, I'm coming for your job. Sorry I'm late. Did I miss any embarrassing deaths yet? Be kid. No, not really. We got plenty of time to get there, though. Well, here's one now. Almost. <laughs> BG, there's some kind of glare coming from the bottom right of the stream. Hmm, weird. Actually, it's a pretty it's a pretty great day. There's a little bit of drizzle today, so not not too much sun through the window. And Brian loves his hot dogs. I can't lie. I watched a few of the old Simon vids just to see the torment. <laughs> uh, Hold on. Am I supposed more? to be hitting her against the wall or not hitting her against the wall? I can't remember. Well, all she does is get a fury by being against the wall. So really, as long as you're not getting hit, it shouldn't matter. The fury right, and armor up because I feel like I'm not doing the backboard brawler here. does. Uh, is there a way to get rid of her armor up? Was I still supposed to be baiting special two or something? Is it her charges? I don't know. I just don't feel like I'm doing enough here. She, I mean, there shouldn't be. It would be the node and if there's, because she doesn't have anything giving her that otherwise. Forgot Hector said I can just relic right after the special two i should have done that right there mm -hmm. there was one crit but only the one yeah yeah the damage was a little better on that one it felt like at least it's a hardcore oh burn did I, wait did i not have no i had to have had buffs is it no required yeah no crits that time okay does she have crit resist Maybe the armor up is giving her, making her more resist or something? Maybe. Or you could just be getting unlucky with the RNG. That's true. Could just be unlucky. You're not... You didn't seem like you stayed unblockable for that long after that. I'm just noticing the duration. The armor node is giving it, the crit resistance. Yeah, Messiah, that's... I think so. When will we get Alliance War rewards? Wednesday or Thursday? Yes, Celebrity Reels. Uh, they said it take up to a week. They're pushing them all manually. So could be as late as Wednesday. Hopefully sooner. Hulkling has horrible crit rate as well. What's up, Ghost Dog? How you doing, dude? No, oh, don't die now. Okay, good. Okay. Jordan Got it down. Nice. Jordan Grissom saying, hey, BG, do you want to be an officer with you and Seton and Metal Sonic dude and Dooley Ray as well? 
Nope. Oh, Jordan. Jordan, you're hilarious. <laughs> no, no thanks, man. I just, uh, I, I just want to chill. Uh, just even want to be in an alliance. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, I'm good to worry about. Uh, MCOC TDC, thank you for the buck. I don't see a message from you, though. Uh, I don't know if there was supposed to be one. But thank you for the buck. I'll check back in uh, a couple minutes if if uh, maybe YouTube ate your message and you want to try sending it again or something. We keep an eye out. Um, all right, first quest down. Let's keep it moving. All right, we'll go quickly if Hulkling was rank four. Cough, cough. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Or Awakened. Eh, Awakened, not that big a deal. I took him up on Awakened to rank four. That extended the duration of those Furies. I feel like that's pretty nice. Yeah, it doesn't hurt, obviously, but it's just not necessary either. Yeah. He's he's great either way. He's he's a god in Battlegrounds. I, I ranked up Hercules first just because I use him in AQ every day and uh, questing and stuff, but damn, Hulkling would be a nice rank five. All right, read your notes. Yeah. All right, looks like we got a weapon node here. Whenever the defender activates a special, they inflict a non-stacking power sting passive on the attacker. Um, okay, sorry. I was I was thinking, do I need to read this? And I, I guess I will. All right, all right. They inflict a non-stacking power <laughs> sting passive on the attacker. 15 seconds. Uh, an opponent with power sting takes 150% of attack as direct damage if they activate a special. Potency and duration of this power sting increases 200% and uh, two seconds for each prowess effect active on the defender max 2000 percent okay that sounds like it'd be a little painful so maybe avoid that um how do we avoid it oh i guess we'll disarm uh wall knockdown okay so knock him down against the wall and then capture with a another heavy okay um that's a pretty cool combo because of the whole like spam and heavies against the the wall technique that people do uh, loose cannon, the defender starts the fight with a protection passive, reducing all incoming damage. Whenever the defender finishes special attack, the shield goes on cooldown. Um, okay, whenever the defender finishes special attack. Got it. Uh, and then aggressive. Okay. Uh. APOC? Cool. Mm, yeah, APOC probably a good one. I'm seeing an Agent Venom on the path. So there's, I think, a nice. Mangog you want to look out for, too. No? There is a Mangog, yeah. Yeah, I probably want to counter for that guy. All right, let's see. Mm, who do I want? The Holy Plunger sent in over $5 saying, I went to an Indian restaurant and it was so good. I got the recipes, but I can't share them because I signed a non-disclosure agreement it's spelled like non-bread okay boo thank you holy plunger why don't you go plunge something boo dude <laughs> oh boy classics all right i'm gonna put apoc <laughs> on the team I might as Place well use plunger uh, do you have well. yeah some more heavies. I'm trying to think, because hmm, like it's it's super easy to heavy them against the wall with Doom, but with Doom I usually don't want them throwing specials, but maybe I still use them anyway. Yeah, Messiah saying this one's pretty annoying. I don't remember this one. Who's on call? I recognize the tone, but his voice sounds deeper today. Uh, Dash, I don't know. You're listening to the smooth sounds of the ball duo MCOC. Mm. If you have Spider-Man, he makes this fun? Really? Which one? Long I'm shot sure just... takes care of Cersei. Uh, I don't know if Brian has a ranked up long shot. Maybe I just AA. There is that option. Someone was saying Domino. Her her team is fun, but that's a bit much to bring all three. I mean, maybe I Hulk still. Just because seven star. And yeah, the, the issue with him is that 
It's anything where you have to heavy can sometimes throw off your rotation with him because for sure. You're getting the gamma rage before you want to, but you do have yeah. the Mangog, so he might be good for that. Mm-hmm. Zobri Man might not be the worst either, now that I can actually heavy with him since they won't be unblockable. Mm-hmm. Maybe I throw him in there. Um... I think I should Stop. put those two in. Ollie. Abdo, do you feel Brian is culturally appropriating you with his bald cap? Uh, no. <laughs> Thank do, you for the question. <laughs> do I keep Doom in here? I guess I do. Ooh. Absorbing Man or... Kingpin, what do you think? Absorbing right, Man's rank four. Yeah. So I don't know if there's anybody else that he, like his immunities or anything, would be good with on the path or ending. I mean, we still he'll he'll end uh, Mangog's um, buffs Stopping. faster too, right? I think so. Um, maybe I'll just keep Kingpin on the team. I don't know. Let's just go. Thinking way Let's too hard moving. about something that's not going to be that big a deal, probably. Mm -hmm. uh, let's roll. Until we get on later on in the fight and you're like, oh, I should have brought this other champion. <laughs> probably, yeah. Uh, uh, Spidey love... Supreme does Cersei. I don't remember if BG has one or even if it's ranked. I have one, but not ranked. So. That might be a good champ to rank up um, for EOP and stuff, though, because I think you have to do the spider one still, right? Mm, yeah. Uh, MCUC, TDC, BG might check in my tweet when you get a chance, please. Um, what's your Twitter? Because I don't think I see an MCUC, TDC here. So let me know what that is, and we can try to take a, a look. Storm Bishop work well on this path? Yeah, Bishop should be pretty good too, right? Uh, is there any way to get generic six-star Awakening Gem free to play while in Thronebreaker? Uh, I don't know, because do you is it like a lot of the side quests now are starting to have generic, but I think that's only for Paragon, so I'm not sure about that. I haven't been Thronebreaker for a while. 100% Act 7, Chris saying? Okay. Okay, we back in Abdo Sip with me. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon, so we'll not. I haven't, haven't eaten anything. <laughs> Maybe this evening, Messiah. We'll see. Decent damage there. It is. I can't remember. How do I get the power stings on again? You have the the weapon node right now. I know. I can't remember how the power stings come about. Mm, I don't know. Thornbreaker gets a crystal every month. Got to be Paragon for generic. We were, we were talking about it in the Lions Act because some of us complaining about how boring the side quest is this month and repetitive and uh, someone else is like yeah but it's easy i'm like yeah if you're high enough rank yeah sure it's easy but also boring doesn't make them mutually exclusive uh actually easy kind of does make it more boring in some cases but someone was saying they weren't necessarily going to finish it and someone else is like well but there's two there's two awakening gems in there and i was just like sweet so i can add them to my 12 other awakening gems i'm not using <laughs> Yeah, uh, it's good that they put him in there because obviously everyone's not in the same position. But uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, but it's like I'm I'm gonna do the side quest anyways because I I go for all the rewards I can. But it made me go and look. I'm like, oh, I have like 31 unawakened champions and legit 12 gems. <laughs> mm -hmm. I was trying to think of a way to make it fun to like let subscribers or members on the channel or something like that uh, pick who to use the gems on kind of randomly or like maybe do a poll. I was, trying, I was trying to think of some kind of game we could play. I think at least with like five of them or something, but not sure.
I still need the six star awakening gem. I only have one extra. Yeah, I mean, I, I had one generic for a while or maybe two. And then that banquet event was just like gems all over the place. Let me see. Whenever the defender activates a special. Oh, so it's just whenever they activate a special. That's when I have, or let me read the capture one. Well, the defender's weapon is on cooldown. The attacker can capture the weapon by knocking down. Yes, I have it. Uh, Mm, after okay so that's it it's just whenever they activate a special they get a power sting i didn't really uh whoops okay never mind i'm not noticing a power sting i feel like i'm doing something wrong hmm i don't know i mean i kind of read it the same way as you do oh wait okay i see when so it still is when i'm activating a special ah oh, man Kind of confusing to me because I feel like if I have the weapon, then it's like it's it should be the opposite person whenever they activate it. But okay, right. Well, plus like right now you're trying to wait. Does so that got rid of the protection when he used a special? Uh, yeah. It this would be a lot better if I wasn't running recoils because again I'm trying to not really activate too many special ones and twos. So I'm not yeah. getting a lot of uh, power stings in the opponent. Yeah. Oh, what's up, Rated P? Good morning, gang. What's up, dude? How you doing? Rated P sending over nine of them New Zealand dollars. Thank you very much, Rated P. Hopefully you are having a good morning. Thank you, dude. I only have like five, but still getting redundant, Ghost Dog. Yeah. It's I mean, because it's a, it's a very good thing for people who are have like a little lower ranked account than than I'd say I do or Brian even but um yeah like I th those awakening gems do absolutely nothing in your account if you don't use them and so I really should use them but I just don't like the champions I have to awaken are Electra or Captain uh <laughs> Captain America World War II and it's like oh man I'm not giving a gem to those guys unless we made a game out of it or something so um, it is MC when, go ahead. MCOC TDC, I, I still don't have a, a message from you of, of what your, your Twitter name is. Uh, if that is what your Twitter name is, then your account might just not set to be publicly viewable, which you'd have to change your, your Twitter settings. But if you have a different name on Twitter, let me know. Because um, I, I, I still have nothing. Just, uh, just, a, just a heads up. I'm not ignoring you, but I just... Don't have any messages from you. Um, Braided P, thank you for. Oh yeah, yeah the uh, nine New Zealand bucks. Thank you. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, much appreciated. Good morning. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, dude. To the gang. This is uh, a an annoying AF path. I mean, it's it's very basic path. I uh, may. I'll try. To, I guess I'll try to take advantage of the node a little bit more. But honestly, it's it's like a non node path like you just herk this down as if there was no nodes here yeah which i guess is a lot of paths yeah that's true well so i like i'm seeing chris gonzalez's message here saying i remember when abdo tried streaming the side quest this month and it wasn't going well so he switched to bgs yeah because i didn't have my herk because people were like oh herk's not even good for this i'm like eh, really because uh, i kind of would imagine he is and I, it was so boring. I actually had to use like a revive or something with the team I had. And I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna come back and do this with my Herc. And guess what? Uh, I, it is still boring, but with Herc, I just like totally get through it fine with no, you know, nothing needed. So it's like, yeah, plus somebody else was like saying, I've run this 18 times. No offense, but I don't necessarily need to watch someone else do it 18 times. Like, yeah, let's go play some Battlegrounds. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, I. Whoops. Watch that. Uh, his protection was down, or or was up actually. Sorry. Uh, so I was like, ah, I probably shouldn't throw my special one right now. So then I thought last second. Well, let me throw a heavy attack instead. And it was two last second, and I just got blasted. Of course. As is tradition now. Uh. Zane Whitener, what's up, Zane? How are you doing? Sending over a dollar. 
And did you have a last? Let me get out the old control F. Uh, oh, not Zen. Zane. Nope, just uh, just sending over a buck. Well, uh, thank you, dude. If you do have another message and YouTube aided or anything like that, try changing around the words. Possibly. What's up, So Habe? How you doing? I told you Herc is good for side quest, Abby Doe. Yeah, I usually people are like, Herc's not good for this. You need to gain buffs. You're like, what? It's just, yeah. You just, you just throw, throw Herc and uh, <laughs> timed all together, and there you go. Uh, Zane, thank you. Yeah, what I've just said. No message here. Last Abby Doe. Uh, all right. Generally speaking, I'm done with reading last on my stream or anyone else's. <laughs> but I'll look, Edwin. Abby Doe, how about a Cav Paragon for gem game? Winner gets to pick which champ you use a gem on. Hmm. Um. Yeah, I mean, it just... It like there's no way to get the paragon crystals without spending. I definitely don't want to do calves. We could do something like that, but God, you saw how long it took for Messiah to to uh, get just one six star out of those calf crystals. I'm trying to use these gems, not just to take a year to <laughs> to do it. So <laughs> I, I appreciate the idea, Edwin, but um, uh, I, I don't know. I think I think we want to do something a little faster. I was thinking kind of like Brian's uh, rank up roulette kind of game. That was fun. I haven't done that forever. Yeah. Hmm. Let's pipe them down. How you doing? Should I rank up five star ghost or five star Titania? Dorian, who do you like playing more? They are both good champions. I think in the right hands, Ghost is the better champion if you're a good Ghost player. If you don't enjoy her playstyle, because it is a little bit different than your average champ, then I would go Titania. Titania is a great champ as well. Was saying I'm back in America weird? Huh, okay. Well, welcome home, Zane. Welcome home. I don't Maybe know what it is. Word. YouTube is, is funky with messages lately. Mm-hmm. I know, I know on my channel it's because the the banning of friendly and friendlies, but because I know people will uh, uh, miss that. But that's such a Schlierum's fault. So, oh, dang. Lorson's favorite eye Hulk here, annoying occasionally. Uh, rate of P sending over another 350 of them New Zealand bucks. Rated P, did you have another message? Or did you just want that big D spot? I think. Oh, what Juan Valdez, how you doing? Old Shang-Chi and Mole Man today, is either of them worth taking to rank three? I also have Atuma, not sure how good he is. Uh, yeah, so hey, I would say both Mole Man and Shang-Chi are. They're both at the toward the top of the skill class. They do a little different things, but they are, are similar in a lot of ways. Um, Mole Man just has like crazy bleed damage though, which is nice in certain scenarios. Uh, they're, they're both great champions, so I'd rank them both up. Atuma is pretty good as a defender. I don't know how he is offensively these days, but like if you... What? I, I'd Holy. probably put him third behind the other two. That was a massive lag spike. We're both moving backwards. Uh, oh, yeah. That shows up clearly on the replay. The video. Holy. Gutta. What's up, Gutta? How you doing? What's up, BG and chat? Haven't been able to catch a stream since I got custody of my son, but I have been watching afterwards. Hopefully I can make it to Vancouver in October and hang out with everyone. Awesome, dude. Well, congratulations on getting custody of your son and uh, happy Father's Day, man. That's awesome. Yeah, dude, um, just in time. That's a big deal. So, yeah, Re replays exist for a reason. I I'm amazed that even with my small little channel, how many, you know, you look at the stats on YouTube and how many replays I get. And uh, dude, I, I love the people watching on replay and, and the lurkers and whatnot. Like shout out to all the lurkers and people watching on replay. You guys are, you guys are MVPs. All right. I, 
Still have nothing from MCOC TDC here. I'm going to pick a tweet at random. Uh, let's see. You sent that message over 20 minutes ago. I got this tweet 19 minutes ago. Maybe this is the one. Uh, it's the closest to 20 minutes. PG, got a question for you. Who would you suggest to be my first rank for? Uh, currently 7.2.5. I'm just trying to gauge what I should take from uh, Battleground Rewards before it comes. Um... It's kind of personal. You don't really need any champ in particular at rank 4. Um, I would prefer going with a sustainable option just to help save resources uh, for those times where you need the healing. So, yeah, Claire heals, King Groot heals. I mean, Kitty is indestructible mm -hmm. but not awakened, so I wouldn't go with her. Um, I'd probably be going with a King Groot myself, but uh, if you don't like King Groot, go with someone else. Oh, wait. That was just... Uh, page one. Uh, I like ooh. red mag there too. It's pretty useful. Doesn't really need awakening. For first rank four, I I, think, I don't think I would do that personally, but I would I would maybe go. So the more sustainable, King I think. I agree. Yeah. Well, you know, Rintrock can heal too, but um, nah. I don't know. Maybe maybe Kingpin, something like that. There's a lot of good it's options. Running... You really can't go wrong with going with a champ that you like. If running recoils, but uh, otherwise the King Groot and Claire both can be more sustainable. Yeah. Claire sucks um, without recoils, though. She's, her damage is not fun. And if that wasn't MCOC TDC, well, whoever I just gave advice to, good luck to you. <laughs> you tried, you tried. Yeah. Um, okay, I think we're caught up on the, uh, the Super Chats then, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um... Unless uh, Rated P said anything else. I don't think so. I think he just wanted the big big D spot. Um, love your content, Abido. Thank you, Edwin. Uh, so, Gutta, thank you, and happy Father's Day to all the dads in here as well. I was going to say, too, uh, as far as Vancouver goes, I did make a Discord server last night, and hopefully I'll put out a video soon. So just, just uh, specifically for Vancouver meetup kind of info. Uh, at the moment, it, I just invited uh, Legacy and Captain Bay and tipped. <laughs> so, and Tip was the only one who was up at like 1 a.m. or whenever I made the Discord. But I'll I'll make a I hope I'll make a video about the meetup here shortly, uh, at least a, like an initial video. And I put the link to the Discord in there, so if people want to do that to talk about how to uh, coordinate for anything outside of um, you know the Kabam stuff. We can do that. So. Oh my Keep god. Out for that. I cannot dex away when he's coming at me with a double medium. I don't know if that's a game issue or if that's a me issue or what, but like. The stealthy issue, he sucks. I, well, yeah, that could be it too. I'll accept that answer. <laughs> can you pronounce my name, Drenoel King? I mean, I can pronounce it. I don't know if I can pronounce it correctly, but yeah. I wish I could meet up with you all, but I got plans. Yeah, yeah, it's rough going to Bali again, Messiah. Uh, we feel real bad for you. <laughs> Looking forward to that, Abdo. I'm currently planning on going right on laser. MCOC TDC, sorry, I'm late. Well, he was asking about your uh, your Twitter handle because he wasn't seeing it specifically from you. So you might have it set to private um, if you have a different name than the name you have on YouTube here, too, then that would be good to know. She got shredded by the sky. Rip. I hate him. He's a butthole. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, my goodness. What's up, Odysseus? DG, your voice changed and your mouth isn't moving? Weird. <laughs> it's not weird. It's pretty normal. Happens uh, a lot to people in life. Oh, no! I'm dying here, too. What am I doing? <laughs> Do you pronounce my name Abdo? Sam Weiss. Sam Weiss. Ocho Cinco Nueve. Uh, uh, 
clipped? What? Talking about the butthole? <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, Sam, Sam Wise, I was just editing the uh, like sponsored featured video and stuff, so uh, definitely, definitely pronouncing your name in there for sure. I was thinking I might make a little short just to show people in case they didn't know how to turn on to accept to memberships too. Just because that'd be like a little quick thing, because I know some people are like, why didn't why didn't I get gifted a membership? It's like you gotta you gotta turn it on to accept that. Alright. APOC is alive and I will swap him out with the boss node. So He's alive. Good. He's alive ish. <laughs> yeah. I guess I'm gonna use try to use Hulk for this fight. This man guy, of course, gonna be probably the worst one to deal with on the path. You got Doom fully healthy too. Yeah. Um, if needs be. Let's go Hulk. I will be uh, excited for you to get your Hulk up to rank two and and uh, live vicariously through that. Should be pretty cool. As the tamest thing Abdo has said, I am occasionally family friendly, appropriate. I forgot I'm really not supposed to be uh, doing full five hit combos, but I wanted him up against the wall. Whoops. Yeah. That's not great. Abdo, how's the doggo doing? Geta, she still needs her surgery. She she has a torn CCL, which is like an ACL in humans. Uh, so she's pretty bored uh, at the moment, but she's, she's okay otherwise. Thank you for asking. Did you do another featured opening since the Hawkeye seven star? No, I, uh, I, that's, that's where we're at. I just put all those together. So I had a couple of the, the first ones, just did a little bit of editing, took out some, some swear words, uh, <laughs> took out some people's names who had inadvertent shout outs. Do you guys like the change to 8.3 having only three pass per quest? I don't know yet. I don't know. I have not messed around with the beta at all, so I'm not sure. You butthead. Are you kidding me? Come on. Use the oh. special one more time. I need your thing. Oh, please don't stop. Did he use his L1 in the middle of your combo? Yeah. Was, was it kind of slowing down my combo? I don't just... think I slowed it down that much, but. Uh. Yeah. Jeez, now everything's going south. I He's got the protection node, so I was like, oh yeah, I'll just, like, I'll wait for the protection to go on cooldown, and then I'll, like, try to special one stun lock him. And, uh, well, when it went on cooldown, stop throwing your specials, dude. When it went on cooldown, um, he also... Unstoppable on me. Mm hmm. Don't forget you can use the striker as part of the stun lock with Hulk nowadays, since you got that on there. Pretty yeah. helpful. Okay. Now throw your special. Throw it, please, buddy. Thank you. Alright, now I need you to not throw a special. Like I said, easy. If you're old enough to get that joke, then it's not inappropriate. <laughs> Kamam stuck with their defender selection on a path where you need to heavy Jabari, Groot. Yeah, super easy to heavy. Thanks. They, well, yeah, they did it on purpose, obviously. Oh, come on. The protection came up at the last second there. No. Or did the damage go through? I'm not sure if the damage went through. Either way. No, the protection came up right before you hit the L2. Bummer. Well. Um, okay. Did BG just say, I need your thing? Hmm. Probably not the first Six time. Probably not the last time. <laughs> uh, yeah, just six fights, three paths. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fine with that. Oh, that's not bad compared to Act 5 with 15 fights, <laughs> fights per path. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, uh, exactly. Did you just say 16 pints 
per pass? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, I, I stumbled over all of those words. <laughs> the, the, re, uh, the intoxicated is coming out of the game right here. <laughs> hey, I am perfectly capable of having mush mouth when I'm dead sober, so. <laughs> okay. Uh, made it to the end here. I... Goodness, do I want to fight this Cersei now with a nearly dead team? Probably not, but I'm considering it. Is Doom good for her on that one? I don't even know. I Probably not. I am. God, I had the worst fight with her in Battlegrounds yesterday. She just, like, starts out with the buffs, so I can't get the heavy, or I can't get the parry for uh, Archangel. So she heavies, and then it was just like, I couldn't do anything. It, I just did this with Wiccan. The exact same thing happened. This is ugly. <laughs> yeah. She can certainly be an annoying defender. Uh. Do more torch yeah. this fight. Yes, I am. Do I just torch uh, Kitty? Oh, you could. Or am I supposed to like I doom this fight or something? Mm. Is I do wait? I is mean, I do him? I forget his immunities. Is he, is he he's incinerated? he's incinerate and shock immune, I believe, right? And he would kill her pretty well with the uh, uh, yeah, Andrew Field saying I doom Kitty. Yeah, I, that would probably be pretty pretty easy with the prowess and stuff. He'd destroy her. Okay, I um. You know, I I'm gonna save that for when I I want to bring like both of those champs. Um, let, let, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to fight Cersei. This is probably gonna be the ugliest fight uh, that I do all stream. I'm, Get it out of the way. I'm thinking it might be. I mean, sh uh, is is it dumb to bring in Void for this fight? Is the question. What are all the nodes? <sighs> So she's unblockable with a with a regen buff, um, and there's buffet. And what I'm thinking is, uh, actually, I guess let me read the other ones again. Stress test. Whenever the attacker blocks a hit, pause all buffs on the defender. I mean, I, I don't really care about that too much. Like it's annoying with the glance and everything, but and then hit me. I dare you. When struck, the defender gains a chit and charge at ten. Uh, all charges are removed. The defender gains an armor up buff. I don't care about that either. I, I really just want to let the buff the debuffs do their thing and then reverse the healing when I have some debuffs. The issue is, once again, recoils. Uh, so I can't really spam my special one. I kind of have to let the game do it for me. And the reversal, it's, it's going to take a little time. And like I could get hit in any number of ways while waiting for that stuff to work. Or, you know, Bring your so. sorcerer instead? Yeah. Um, I mean, yeah, lots of different options. It, the cow is not with, ranked up. Sorcerer with recoils again is just a nightmare. Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. Mojo, eh, I didn't build him up at all. I feel like this is this is a, a bad time to do this, and I really sh maybe I should just. Ah, uh, do I just throw a whole cling in and, and go fight that penny again? You could. Neutralize can be better than nullify. Yes, for sure. Her power gain can get out of hand, and the glancing is the icing on the cake. Yeah. Yeah, I generally like the new like cows is the the cows is just great because you know it's any hit either way. Um, maybe I save this. I'm sure there's a better path where I'll be healthier. All right, I'm going to go Hulkling and just go fight that, um, that Penny. You do already have that Doom, though, too, as backup. I don't know if Doom would be great for this. I don't know about great. Uh, Messiah said Doom could do it, though. Mm. Well, too late. I Tiger and Doom on this fight, Messiah saying. Best Cersei counter is Hood. Hood? I, I don't use Hood too often. I do have my rank three. I'm 
try not to back her up against the wall this time. Oh no, that's bad. She's already taking a lot of damage. <sighs> While trying to save resources, I might have just cost myself a whole bunch of resources. <laughs> that's nice. Uh, that'd be a classic BG maneuver. Oh, I really need you to back up. Thank you. Of course, I... Messed up my special three now. Yeah, this is this is going <laughs> splendidly. Uh, I just did this fight and it was fine, and, and now I'm I'm throwing it. Uh, it's okay. Hulkling is uh, he, he's he's too OP. He'll you'll you'll get it. Be fine. Let's hope so. I'm noticing getting more crits already without her having that armor up, though, so it's nice. Yeah. From the backboard brawler thing or whatever. Mm hmm. Although, no crits on the special two again. What the hell, man? Get over here. Over here. Classic scorpion. Oh yeah. I haven't played that for a while. No, I mean they're coming out with a new one. Mm -hmm. Or is it out already? <laughs> I don't remember. I my former coworker liked Mortal Kombat a lot, so I've not played that since she was hanging out over here more. Mm -hmm. Come on, Penny. Okay, yeah, I'm just not critting on my special, so, uh, screw it, I'm just gonna... You want backboard brawl or whatever? Fine, I don't <laughs> care. Uh, what an annoying champion. Maybe I do care. Get over here, please, Benny. Gosh. The leader from the game. <laughs> yeah. Uh... MK wasn't gonna bang so hard. Is it the name of it? It's like they're just resetting at one. Yeah, I think it's has to do with like some of the origins of the characters or something like that. Uh, I I can't really remember. I didn't. Well, I say I can't really remember, but I I guess I never really looked into it. I just was hearing through the grapevine that that's a little bit of what they're doing. So might be misquoting. Mm -hmm. Intercept. Get that fury. Is there foresight oh, on this? Oh, there is. Yeah. Oh, well, it's yeah. It's a little hard to taking... intercept with the special, too, but I guess um, I could be doing it for just regular attacks like that. Yeah, get the fury. Yeah, because you don't. I don't. Do you get foresight fury when you intercept with the special, even? Uh, yes, but. It, I, I think so, at least, but it, ha I, it has to be, like, a true intercept, and according to Kabam, doing the little, like, dash back special, even if you only move a millimeter, that doesn't count as an intercept. Hmm. Um, so, yeah. Uh, unless you're you using know, Hercules, because, he... like, it depends on which character you're using, and for some reason it works with Hercules. Yeah, because it's one of his feats, probably. Um, no, in September, the timeline is being reset for a second time. Gotcha, Marlin. Thanks for the info. 
All right, next path here. Let's read aggression cruelty every two seconds on a timer. Gain a cruelty passive, increasing crit damage by 150% per stack. Okay, bob and weave two. All of the defender's attacks are guaranteed critical hits. This is disabled for eight seconds if the attacker dodges or intercepts the defender. Okay. Power of vulnerability. Okay. Whittle down. This defender takes no debuffs. Okay. Uh, do not disturb three. The defender has 100% increased ability accuracy. Uh, each non-damaging debuff reduces the potency. Okay. Um, all right. Who do we have on this path? Not looking too crazy. I'm going to be using Eye Bomb, King Groot, uh, Hulk. Um, maybe this is a good time to bring in Torch. Um, but save his life or mm -hmm. void and save his life, depending on who I want to fight for the boss. Um, let's take a look around. Many ranks uh, up his jugs and gets him awakened. What is that for? When I'm going to use jugs or when I'm going to put him? Talking about could he use for Cersei too. Ah, I see. I think uh, that's it. Uh, yeah. Ahmed Ahmed Ali, later beautiful bald head man. Well, have a good one, Ahmed. I assume you're talking to me. Probably. Mm -hmm. Um. Who else do I want to use? Um. I could use. Oh, no, Macho. Go ahead. I was gonna say I could I could use spot. I would just have to be really careful because they could crit through block. So oh, that'd be a nightmare. It's only an eight second cooldown. Mm. Yeah, he has rank three jugs. Should probably bring in Archangel, I guess. When is BG gonna do the jugs EOP run? Did you do that one already, or which one did you do? I'll bring in Howard as well for the non damaging debuffs. Sorry, thinking of two different things here. Yeah, uh, hang on he... one sec. I, I think this might be the team that I bring. Is this good? I don't know. Let's just try it, I guess. Ah, I'm still thinking about bringing in Void. Um, I don't need all these guys, do I? Five star Void, so we can just go really slowly. Well, no, just for the, the, the boss, the Cersei boss. I'll put my, my oh. six-star void in. And then I could swap someone else in later on. I feel like there's a lot better options for that Cersei than void. <sighs> he did robot easy. Oh. How many more pass I'm hiding from my family at the moment? Ghost Dog, I think he's got... Uh, this This will be his third pass, so four more to go. Yeah, not too many. Moving a little slow today. Wow. All right, I'm gonna do this. What? That wasn't wasn't an insult. It was just accurate. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> well, All right. Well, for you've only had one restart, right? Well, you you restarted one path. Um, but you've kind of spent a lot of time thinking about what champions to bring, so, shall we say. I feel like this is my normal speed, but... Whatever! <laughs> um, alright, I'm gonna throw in Hulk for this one. I really miss the old Act 4 kind of quest designs with that one-star Spidey and that path that you could take multiple times to make it really easy or really difficult and just do same. once. Oh, big same, yeah. I, I miss I it know. too. I, I miss the any kind of personality in these quests. Thanks yeah. for talking about this in a um, uh, in a different chat of like um, what's it called? Like six point one point three had that whole big thing where you could like loop around um, uh, and like take take like the entire map in like one path if you really wanted to or you could uh like break it down into smaller chunks um yeah that jugs fight's another great example the 
This guy's getting destroyed. Venom fight? The Venom fight, that was cool. The There's also... Oh, what other example did I give? Oh yeah, the 6.2.6 .6 had those loops and you could choose to mm -hmm. do one loop at a time or try to double, triple, mm -hmm. quadruple up. Um, it's fun. Um, it, like, I don't know. I, I What I've realized from... Uh, like returning to, to 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 WoW Classic for that period of time was uh, uh, one of the devs when they were like interviewing a, a, about it. He said, um, "Like the world is the main character," and I realized that's what I really like about games. Is um, obviously all the characters we're playing as are extremely important too, but like the world has to be one of the characters. Uh, for me to, yeah. to really enjoy the game. And uh, I, I just feel like this has no character to it. It's just six fights, boss. Six fights, boss. Uh, it's so... Oh, Land and generic. Know. Land and generic. And it's it's fine to do this sometimes. Not everything needs to be this uh, novel experience or whatever. Well, But this is kind of what like the the event quest is. So it'd be nice if the story did something a little more interesting. Yeah, um, and even sometimes in the in the event quest, I, I think they could stand and do something more interesting too. Uh, and sure. more interesting does not mean more difficult always, or any, you know, for the people mm -hmm. that are like, oh, but I don't want it to be difficult. It does. It still doesn't have to be. Um, they could still but be the character, balanced. like you mentioned with those other fights for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Like, so I think in the monthly event quest, one time they had it where the the final quest, it was just that Thanos boss, right? Yeah, where it yeah, was just the name of Thanos. Yeah, and like, that was really cool. So that time, that month, you didn't have to go through a million different paths that were all the same and everything. And mm -hmm. um, it was a tough fight. So that one maybe, maybe was more uh, difficult for some people for sure. But... Um, yeah, man, it just had that, that personality to it. I liked it. Mm -hmm. This is the entire problem with the community, though. There are also lots of people who don't want to think about it. Generic is exactly what they want. Eh, yeah, but you could do... Kind of. I think you could do both things, like Brian is saying, where... Yeah, you know, satisfy both. So you can you can do EQ to be that kind of thing most of the time, but then with story content, since it is permanent content, so even if it is more difficult, uh, you can go back and do it. You don't have to rush through it, whatever. Uh, that you can make that have a little more character. I I do uh, I do like that. Yes, and or I think uh, guys for asking about uh, where Danny went, 102 million I think is the cutoff or somewhere around there. Or like I said, it's it's totally fine to have some of the quests that look like this. Uh, it, it's just all six of them in the chapter is, I don't know, man. Like, just, you, you can have, you can have, you could even have half. <laughs> to make half the quest look like, great. Uh, do something more interesting with the other half. Or, like, I don't know, one or two quests, even. The more than half could look like this. That's fine. Well, they all look like this. It just feels like, I don't know if I'm in 7.1 or 9.11 right now like I, I how would how do you how do you define this like obviously i know where i'm at i have it in the title and the thumbnail and stuff like that but if someone just tunes in and they look at this map it could be it could be any one of these quests they're all the same <laughs> yeah well i think they spend most of their time and focus now on making the boss fights interesting which i think they've done a pretty good job with most of those end stage bosses like the the bahama fight is going to be fun for you and uh, Scoliosis boss was kind of fun. And, you know, Collector, Grandmaster, all those different things are fun fights. And the that's boss great. Cool, yeah. So, like, but they, it's like they put all their focus on making those cool and then have stopped doing the things that were like a little more interesting with the paths, like we were talking about. So, yeah, the bosses are, are great. I think uh, mm -hmm. I've got no complaints on those. They're, they're fantastic. And this is, this is a great example where it's like, yeah, there's a, a unique boss at like the end of a chapter and there's not a unique boss for all the other quests and that's fine. Mm -hmm. Like you have, oh no, oh God, I didn't mean to dash in. That was a total accident. Um, but yeah, you don't need to have uh, 
anything crazy going on for every single quest. That would be too much in the uh, opposite direction of like... Mm -hmm. oh I agree you mean about Diablo and the world too, because like I... That's one of the things, so uh, I don't think you don't care that much about sci-fi, but one of my favorite shows recently was The Expanse. And also the books, The Expanse are great too, but they, the like showrunners or producers, directors talked about how they tried to make space kind of feel like a character. So it was really threatening that that environment was, it was it's a more hard sci-fi where they don't have, you know, warp drive or hyperdrive or that kind of stuff. So they have to actually use more realistic physics basically. And things about being in a space environment are all important aspects of the show. Uh, you know, with like the cold and the vacuum and the lack of oxygen and, and just a way of making the environment be kind of just stand out and be almost one of the characters, like something you have to interact with. And I, I feel like I understand what you mean about that for Diablo in that same sense. It was, it was for World of Warcraft, but yeah. Oh, yeah, sorry, World of Warcraft. Yeah, same. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> same, same thing, whatever. Whatever, some kind of fantasy stuff. Abdo pretending he reads. Oh. I'm going to just literally read that message easy, but yeah. I can't believe I got roasted this hard by a defender. That's pretty easy, ultimately. Bummer. MSD. <laughs> that eye bomb was going to be my answer to uh Your boy take him down. Yeah, dang. <laughs> Most of the time is spent on preparing offers and making up new money grabbing things like the new store. Act 8.3 is three pass now. The act rewards get outdated in a short time. I don't know if I'd say that exactly, but. Um... Well, like, so here's the crazy thing is the characters these days are 10 times more complicated than they mm -hmm. ever were. And then the world is like 10 times more dumbed down than it ever was. <laughs> so like they they do a lot in this game to um add like all these ridiculous details to characters um and uh that that's great uh, most of the time sometimes i feel like it's maybe a bit too much the same way that some people would have said like you know maybe certain quests were a bit too much or something um but yeah i I wish they put some of those details into the world itself, is the thing. Well, there's um, just going to be times where they have some overreactions, like people complain about how difficult Act 6 was, uh, and then they maybe just overreact by going the opposite direction a little bit too much. But those corrections will happen in both directions back and forth, and so maybe they'll have a time, maybe Act 9 will be a different, more interesting story environment, you know? You just have to wait and see. I think I'm going to try to Hulk this still, but dang, man. I really did intend on using uh, Eye Bomb for yeah. not only Sassy, but also Doom down here. Well, you got uh, Despair 3 out of 3, right? You said so. Should Doom. still work with Hulk's debuffs. I'm almost Hang tempted to, to use King Groot for this fight. Mm. It's different departments that work on stuff like offers and such, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, no, you're right, Martin, for sure. Actually, maybe I'll, I'll use Howard for this one. I fully explored 8.2.6 today. Can anyone help me choose who to awaken and who to rank for next? Can do two. Well, yeah, but you didn't say whom. <laughs> you can't armor break Sassy, right? I think you can. Mm, yeah, I don't think he's... Chat helps out real quick. Is is sassy armor break immune? I don't think so. Just resistance to frostbite. Oh, armor break debuffs. Okay, never mind. Cold versus sassy is annoying because wrath uh, can stop the stun lock mid combo. Yes, that is true. I did find that out in battlegrounds the other day, and it was annoying. Oh, sassy is armor break immune. Okay, yeah. Yeah, he is. Well, you could just torch and use a couple of pots for him later on. That's true. Could have done that. Yeah, yeah. Just don't go for stun lock when he's in wrath, because it'll be a mess. Okay.
Uh, honestly, Act 5, probably the toughest content in terms of nodes and global nodes. Being Thronebreaker, it's not as difficult now, but back then it was really a challenge to get through. It was just a challenge because, yeah, some of the gates and that kind of stuff. I, I would say overall, the first couple times doing the uh, the champion boss, though, would be the, the toughest thing for me, for sure, going through the game. That was very frustrating. Act 5.3 was rough when it came out. Yeah, it was, it was tough. Like I said, I'm. For me, it was the champion. Whoa, game's getting super laggy. Mm, restart after this. <sighs> oh, dang it. Okay, Wrath mode is over. But I do not have much in the way of... Oh, actually, here we go. Yeah, this will be fine. I think I can still knock here. Tease, right? Just oh yeah, yeah. Martin uh, T is what yeah, started this conversation. Read. Yeah, okay. Martin, I thank you, dude. He sent that over right afterwards. Sorry, I didn't shout it out though. Much appreciated. I mean, I in some of these fights, I'm I, I, I I'm catching things, but again, just kind of missing bits and pieces. So yeah. All right. Um, this is gonna be a bit annoying I don't really know what I mean honestly Hulk is probably my best bet here just stun locking but I think I want to try to save him and I'm trying to think I, I, I don't know if King Gru can survive a special three but it might be worth trying the only problem with him is I, I can't use special twos but I think through parry vulnerability and just armor breaking on special ones, I'm gonna give it a go. Let's try. Do you have? Do you want to use him for any other fights? Because then otherwise, just go for it. Yeah. Yeah, not really. He's he was here partially for synergies, and partially mm -hmm. just because yeah, I could use him for fight if needed. Oh, pal, don't. Not already. Thank you. God. Bait early, bait off him. Oh, hey BG, should I rank two six star Gore, rank five five star Nimrod, or rank five five star Awakened Guardian? Uh, he'll probably do, let's, let's get that after he's done with the fight so he can concentrate here. Um, what was the options? I heard Nimrod and Guardian. What was the other one? Uh, so they're rank five five star Nimrod, or five star Awakened Guardian, or rank two six star Gore. Um, I think that Nimrod is the way to go. Yeah, if you're if you're that position of uh, those rank of materials where the rank two six star would be there, then I think that Nimrod would be more beneficial probably at this point to you. He's a beast. He'll be um, useful for a while, even after you get rid of your five stars for the most part. He just destroys the mutant class so well that he yeah he's he's one that'll have some staying power for sure. Right, BG and throw this quick. Good. BG and Abdo, should I use 2,000 units to finish Exploration 8.2 or spend on July 4th? Noah, I would uh, probably wait and see what the offers look like and then go for it because we are, yeah, you know, about two weeks away. So I would I would wait and see what the offers look like. Try and grind out a little bit more in the arena if you can, because usually there's like a 3K offer. It's usually like one and then three or whatever I think, right? So that or 4k is that what we yeah there's a 1k a 4k and a 10k usually so if you could get up to a little a little better a little more units there you um might have a shot of getting two of them if they're any good but i would definitely since we're so two weeks away might as well just see what you got and that whole time you can spend building up your stash for doing 8.2 as well hope i survive um, this oh yeah i'm gonna survive it totally fine you shouldn't have to use 2k units on 8.2. Well, there's that as well. Kate, okay, yeah, as well. Um, 
it, it shouldn't be that costly for you. I always suggest, you know, what, what Brian suggests too, and the uh, just just building up your stash as you go before you do chat tackle difficult content. It's 4K. Yeah, yeah, that's that's a that's meant ghost dog. Thank you. You know, void uh, would have been good for this fight too, actually. Yeah, would have stopped the power game. Dan, let's go BG fan from New Zealand. Awesome, Dan. Good morning to you. Thank you to you. Oh, good, good morning to Miss Jane, too. I was going to say hi to you. I saw you popping in the chat saying it was way too early. Hope you're doing well, Miss Jane. If you're still here. I'm going to try to Hulk this, I guess. How do you find Hulk versus Doom? I think it's all right. Uh, yeah, that's not usually a bad one. Um, there's, like, I'd much rather use Hulk versus Doom than Hulk versus Rinshaw. That kind of stuff. Or Sassy, for that matter. Mm. The the low... His low crit kind of sucks, but then again, you know, Doom has so much crit resistance anyways that we're going to be critting that much with any champions. Yeah. I just wouldn't go for stun lock and, like, tell maybe the second time. Yeah. You might be able to, because, uh, like, in, in Battlegrounds with a 200k health pool... You can get it done, but it's kind of dicey. It gets a little bit close with a 500k health pool on this. I think you'd want to go through twice, probably. Oh, come on! I couldn't get the partial evade. No! My damage was just popping off. Come on. I was actually just going to maybe go for it there. Uh oh, damn. You, yeah. It's annoying. Mm hmm. All right, well. Oh, no. I. I flamed on what? and I shouldn't have flamed on. I need debuffs. Oh, yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Ahmed, what's up? How you doing, man? Uh, English only in chat, though, please. Um. No, Chris. Try to think. I I could technically do this fight with King Groot, uh, because I get poisons from I bomb, and then I can drop my special two poison. Uh, or I can just pop and revive now. Ah, screw it. I'm gonna try with King Groot. Uh, this is probably a dumb move because I'll pro it'll probably make me waste a revive later on or something. Um, uh, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm not going to be able to trigger the poisons until my, my furies go away. So I'm going to have to get rid of the... Oh my god, buddy. <laughs> I, can't, I can't actually dex him to get rid of his thing. Oh my god, the lag. Holy cow. Oh yeah, you didn't restart. I'm trying to remember that for the next one. English only, I never knew that. Uh, yeah, Jesse, just because, uh, you know, most of us are just speaking English, so it just makes things easier on Brian and the moderators if we just keep it to English only. So, uh, just, in, you know, just in case anyone's saying anything inappropriate in a different language Holy and we wouldn't realize it. crap! Yeah, everyone in the world is, is welcome here, but... Uh... What Abdo said is accurate. We have to uh, be able to understand what people are saying to protect from potential, um, you know. Hate someone trolling, that kind yeah, of stuff. Yeah, 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 exactly. Not everyone knows multiple languages. That is true. Unofficial Ramazan Badur. How are you doing today? Gosh. What's up, Luke F? I don't know if I said hi to you either. Everyone's welcome. It's true. Abdo can barely speak English, but he's in here all the time. Yes, that's accurate. Wow. 
I mean, I was just stumbling over. No, no, no. I did not think he was going to chuck that special, too. Oh, man. That was, uh... He was... Whoops. Yeah, you were early on the dash back. He was okay, pretty far your... away from me, so I didn't think he was going to do it. Restart your game for lag issues before you forget it again. Yeah, I guess so. Abdo speaks intoxicated. I mean, when I'm intoxicated, I do tend to speak more. Yeah. Matthew Wynn. Hey, Brian, how's it going? See, I can properly pronounce a last name. You know? BG, any tips for 6.2? Who's the boss in 6.2? Uh, well, which which part of 6.2? Yeah, that's fair. I'm trying to remember what's in there. Um, the best tip I have for you, Subby, without getting into more specifics... Oh, yeah, I have these boosts expiring. I forgot. Because uh, there's a lot of different fights in 6.2. Is uh, A lot of people have said that they've used guides from uh, the YouTube channel MCOC Noob. And uh, it has helped to give some ideas of, um, you know, who to get uh, through the quest with. So I'd recommend that channel. Yes, definitely. Um, that's what everyone says. I would love to do, I should do like a new Wait, account challenge. What? Where is this guy? Use it to make some guides. Is this guy immune to ins Oh, it's because I have the bleed on me. I'm like seeing the incinerate message pop up and go away so quickly. Oh, just, yeah. Classes path, I think, 6.2.2 Sinister Boss. Yep, so for that Sinister Boss, you do need someone who uh, is poison immune and can get an active fury. That's always a good thing. You can do that with a synergy or just a champion who does it on their own. Ah, oh, this is not good, the position I put myself in once again. This was definitely the path that uh, I wanted to fight a different boss with. Ooh. We have Torch. I do you have torch, torch. Go pity, right? I have Torch, but like he's he's missing so much health now. By the time I start that fight with the bleed, uh, I'll be at half. So, have you used a potion in 2023? Yeah, I mean they exist, but I mean. <laughs> uh. MCOC noob didn't really come into his own as far as guide maker until Act Seven. KT's guides are better for Act Six. Okay, got you easy. All right, I am going to, I guess, just just swap name me out the, the kitty easy. Uh, Brian doesn't have ranked up him run. I guess I'm gonna swap out the duck and try to use. Uh, Is the duck I not do. useful for kitty? I don't think so. Let's let's try I Dooming, even though I still don't really know how to play I Doom. <laughs> well, let's do. Um, any tips for Act three point one point four point five seven at five nine? So you're asking for tips on pie. I would suggest uh, some uh, vanilla ice cream, maybe depending on the pie. Wow, bold, bold mm -hmm. choice. It's like a little apple pie, maybe maybe a little vanilla ice cream. All right, let's. let's yeah, my see. grandma did was a uh, little, little cheddar cheese on apple pie, heated up. Actually, pretty tasty. Of course, she also put salt and pepper on cantaloupe, so it's also tasty but weird. Okay. <laughs> Rintra was great for Cersei. Yep, and that suggestion uh, never gets oh, old. Oh God, I'm still not supposed to do that. What'd you do? Intercepted, and now I'm pretty much dead. Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh man. And this, he does do so much damage to her. Oh, God. Oh. I do that so often, fighting her, where I'm like, wait, oh, she had three? Oh, great. <laughs> Thought I had her in the corner and didn't do that. Intercepting, sometimes you just you get so used to doing it, too, that, yeah. I would have smoked that fight with I Doom. Jesus. Mm -hmm. No, Subi, you can, but there's a uh, synergy between Angela and Heimdall where if you dash back, you get a, a, a Fury. 
So you need that, but you can do so you can have anyone else on your team who's poison immune and use that synergy to dash back. Same what uh, Sanscript was saying too about the uh, Warlock and Ultron. I think is even better because Warlock can heal block um, the Sinister, and those two. Then you get a anytime you're immune to something, you get a Furious that works as well. Okay, I feel dumb now. Don't feel dumb, dude. No reason to feel dumb. That's what we're here for, helping each other out. Meaty. And I'm, I'm not going to do squat for damage with Torch here because I don't have my pre-fight. So this is this is lovely. I, I, I royally messed this up so bad. You're still taking it down a percentage every couple of hits, so you can, you can get this done. BG, in case you didn't know, I Doom has a nice synergy with Penny where if the opponent is immune to his shocks, he applies an incinerate instead. I didn't know that. Thanks, Chris. The Dark Star. No pre-fight. Yeah, he used it earlier accidentally. Yeah, thanks, man. No problem, Subi. We're happy to help. Don't feel don't feel dumb. If you feel dumb, just look at Brian fighting Kitty with Torch. Hmm, Philip. <laughs> Here I am complimenting the community, and you gotta go say something like that, but also kind of accurate. <clears throat> Please do more damage. <laughs> uh, Come on! Yes! Oh, woo. <laughs> okay. Guys, I just wanted to make it interesting. Uh, you know, that's, that's, that's all. Oh, God. Make it interesting content, you know. All right. Um, damn, man. I do really was shredding that fight. I, I wish I didn't intercept there. That would have been nice. Would do that one going forward be easier? I don't know, because I feel like I make that mistake with Kitty all the time. And knowing myself, I'm I'm going to I'm not going to stop making the mistake. It's going to keep happening. I just it's like a, it's just a <clears> reflex, <throat> you know? Um, yeah. Yeah. I could only intercept against Kitty and Mighty Charge and, you know, <laughs> yeah. Rhino sometimes. Uh-huh. If Abdo okay. and BG had a synergy in game, what would it be called? Oh, I don't know. We'll, we'll think about that after he reads these nodes here. Yeah, let's see here. Arrogance, every 10 hits on the attacker's combo meter, flicks them with a falter passive. Oh, this is just that cosmic node. Yeah, it is. Um... Okay. Uh, each time a cosmic attacker lands an attack, they have a 15% chance for, uh, well, excuse me, each unique buff uh, to gain a vigilance buff, uh, preventing attacks from missing for five seconds. If the attacker has a true strike, true sense, true accuracy buff, this vigilance buff lasts for an additional flat five seconds. Um, counter strike using the dexterity mastery to dodge and attack grants, grants the attacker a passive fury charge. Uh, increasing attack rate, okay, yeah, don't gain too many. Uh, oh, it's only at five Fury Charges. Oh, wow. Uh, mm -hmm. They usually give you ten. Okay. Hmm. Scary. Uh, nowhere to hide each time the defender... Uh, here we go, this is what I was looking for. Each time the defender's miss effect is prevented, cosmic attacker skin, and a definite Fury passive. Okay, and then enhanced abilities. Okay. This would actually be maybe pretty fun to use, like, Gam Gam on. If, had, if someone had, like, a seven-star Gam Gam, I would actually take her on this path. No, this is clearly a Venom the Duck path, obviously. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> um, all right, Angela, well, I'm going to... Odin pre-fights, Hulkling. You could even bring, like, two Odins. And do you have a five and a six-star? Put them on two different champions. Hulkling and GCGR. Um, I don't know if I'm going to bring... Two, but I definitely want to bring one. Bring Heimdall. You can dash back and get that uh, Fury. We, although that would actually kind of screw you up, right? Because you'd always have one. So never mind. Don't do that. Uh... What's up, Bungus? How you doing, Hobbit? Yo, Hobbit. Let's see, who do I want to bring? I, man, I almost want to bring Howard the Duck for uh, for this Killmonger fight, but I probably won't. 
Does Howard get a bunch of Furies though? Anyways, I forget. Oh, he does. Yeah. So that that would not be good. That would not be good. Noel, yeah, Noel would be good. Love you, Abdo. Love you too, Hobbit. Hope you're doing well, man. I still gotta make that finish that video of of uh, me uh, kicking your booty in battlegrounds. <laughs> I keep forgetting to finish that up. Whoa. The language, holy cow. I know, bungus and booty at the same time. Crazy. CGR for Killmonger, BG? Oh yeah, you, that's a good point. You should totally bring CGR for that Killmonger. Oh, I'm bringing CGR, all right. And just anyways. Um, yeah. Um. Just opened a six star crystal and got a Nimrod. Nice, dude. I'm so annoyed because it rolled over Doom. I don't know how to feel about this. Oh, I'd feel great. I use Nimrod way more than I use Doom. So depending on like if you really want a prestige or something, but uh, Nimrod actually has decent prestige, but I, I would r much rather give Sig Stones and an Awakening Gem to Nimrod and rank him up because he gets so much more damage. But Nimrod is, he just, he just destroys the entire mutant class basically besides like Bishop. So he's, yeah, great. Medusa for Killmongers, that would work too, but um, I don't think Brian has ranked up six star Medusa. So, I mean, Noel, you don't think he needs to be awakened for this path, does he? I can't, honestly, I, I kind of forget how to play him. I know you want to, like, medium, and then you heavy at some point or something. Uh, at least you forgot how to play him. I've never known how to play him. <laughs> I, I mean, I don't gain a lot of buffs with him, though, right? I kind of need buffs for this path. Yeah, you want buffs. Yeah. Does, he, he, does, does Noel have any kind of anti-miss thing? I don't think so, right? I'm not sure. I'm honestly thinking about tossing in Venom. Yeah, Venom would be good for this path, for sure. And you could uh, put that maybe. Venom Relic. You could put the... Oh, you already put the Relic on CGR, though. I'll, I'll, I'll put Hulkling in here. Let's just go like the this. Ve the Venom Relic on Venom is, is good. But yeah, yeah, just go Hulkling. Yeah. He gets Let's his go. own buffs. Oh, crap. I... This was not the way I said... Oh, man. At the start of the stream, I said I was going to go... Clockwise, this is supposed to, or counterclockwise, this is supposed to be the last path. Whoops. Well, well. <laughs> uh, I'm just going to keep going. Now we're going okay. clockwise, everybody. Uh, <laughs> it only matters for the people that are that are watching on the playback and trying to find a specific path. Uh, right. So I'm sorry to those people if you even hear this. Um, but okay, let's... Let's start with Angie here. Or maybe I want to start with King Groot here, actually. Yeah, I do. Let's start with King Groot. Uh, Hobbit just saying you, you never learned how to play Null. Like, yeah, I don't I don't think I did either. I have met rank three Sig 200, and I have still never bothered to learn him, really. He just always feels slow to me. Which... I, you know, I, that's because I'm not playing him correctly. I think. Noel doesn't need to be awakened anyway. No, he doesn't. Um, it's just nice. It's faster. Well, the, the really nice thing about Noel right now is that, um, uh, you know, I've got recoils on, and he's he's great with them compared to he most is, of my yeah. champs, which are not. Mm-hmm. I love Noel. Noel's not a complicated champ. Yeah, he's I didn't not say complicated. He was. It's just you Reading. still need to know what to do a little bit. So, oh, whoops. Why is no one talking about Iceman? He's immune to every damaging debuff except shock and degen, and, and he has burst damage. Oh, uh, in what? In what context? Because for this, there'd be no reason. This, you know, we need cosmic champs here. So, if you just mean in general in the community, Legacy has a video on Ice Bro, and totally loves him. So, I, I have him in my battlegrounds deck. I'm at rank four. So here's the reason why he doesn't get as much attention as maybe like Hercules. Um, Hercules is immune to death. <laughs> yeah. It's one thing to be immune to damage types. And I like Iceman, so this is not a, uh, a knock against Iceman, but like... Yeah, I think it's pretty clear that um, 
other champs have more damage and you don't need 45 immunities in a fight anyway. Mm -hmm. Unless it's the death immunity. I, I, I like Ice Bro in Battlegrounds. He's a decent defender, except for everyone seems to draft Warlock instantly after I, like, it'll be like, <laughs> like, in my last two picks, I take Ice Bro. I'm like, ha, because they got mutant, or they got no tech, they got no good counter, and they they have that last three that they can select from, and naturally it's Warlock every time. <laughs> but yeah. in general, he's good for that. He can he can do some damage and be good on offense, too. Mm -hmm. It's a little trickier for because he's not the fastest. It'd be nice if he was just a little faster, a little more damage. I'm trying to think if I want Even to put all of these buffs on uh, Angie. <sighs> I'll just go two. For a death immunity, I still figure out how to die with Herc. Oh yeah, for sure. But that's why, Hobbit, I have my 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 secret MVP is Heimdall. Her, Heimdall goes just basically anywhere that Herc goes for me. Because then you got two immunities, except for against stupid annoying dooms or something. What's up, giant walrus? Afternoon to you. How you doing? If you want damaging debuff immune, just have Ghost. She's immune to everything and gets extra damage out of it. And almost everything. Heavy until special one. Continue to heavy to corruption after corruption. Medium light, 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 light to special two. Special two should most likely be death. Otherwise, repeat for null. Yeah, I don't, I don't understand how he gets his corruption, though, even, so... <laughs> Uh, when do War Season Rewards come out? Drink! Glad when. They're, they said it would be a week because they're pushing them manually, so, you know, up to a week. So, by Wednesday, probably. Are you the leader of 4BG's Abdo Chase? I unfortunately am. It's true. I started my own Wow. Lines. Wow. Wow, unfortunately am. You should be the proud leader of the of the people that join you. Holy crap. Someone dethroned this man as leader immediately. Uh, hey man, my boys are awesome, but being a leader or an officer in the alliance sucks. So No, that's true, I agree. There's there's no two ways about it. I am proud of my alliance. My alliance is awesome. My my boys are kick ass. But actually having to do the work of leader or Alliance officer, shout out to all the officers in your alliances, guys, because they do tons of work and it is uh, annoying for just playing a video game, trying to have everything run smoothly. This is true. <clears throat> not almost everything, Abdo. She's immune to everything. She's not. Ghost isn't immune to degen. She can't turn that into a fury, can she? I mean, to armor break either. Yeah, or armor break. Yeah, suck a slurm. Uh. uh... Actually, a D-Gen, she, she can, though, but it's... Can't she? I thought she couldn't turn that. That was the one that she couldn't. It's, the if, it's break, a, yeah. if it's a debuff, um, mm -hmm. yeah, if it's passive, then no. Um, just got 10k 5-star shards. My only other 5-star is Warlock. Well, that's a good one. And I have a tech duel crystal in shop. Should I wait for a different duel or rip it? I mean, if that's your only five star, then I would say just do a basic. You, you're, I wouldn't worry about doing dual ones and targeting anything specifically yet. Um, if if there, I mean, mm, there's some certain reasons you could go for certain classes, but generally speaking, if you got one five star, nah, just just rip it and pray to Kabam Jesus. Good luck, dude. You guys looking for anyone next season? Chase, unfortunately not. I, I'm hoping, well, actually no, for the for the Alliance, that's a good thing. I'm hoping that we're set and good to go, that no one's gonna be leaving as far as I know, and no one's gonna need to get kicked for um, not meeting our minimum score. But we do have a wait list. The wait list is pretty extensive at this point. I'm always happy to add anyone to the wait list though, Chase. So if you find my channel and go to my Discord and you wanna send over your, uh, you know, screenshot your profile, hit me up that way, feel feel free. But I don't think we'll need you in this next next season. It's kind of crazy. We got like a, I think the way this is like around 25 people now. Although there, some of them were 
put on there when the prestige requirement was lower. Uh, so I'd have to re-talk to some of them about if they've if their prestige has gone up. Mm. I should have brought my void on this path. Um, because I don't need all these champs. Just need King Groot. Hmm. You're dead set on doing that fight with Void, huh? I would like to. <laughs> uh, but I don't want him to be the only option, because then if I mess up, yeah. Bad yeah. times. King Groot regen is broken. It's pretty busted. Are there any good resources for learning how to fight against specific champs? Snordsman. Yes, Arena. <laughs> uh, if you do Arena regularly, you're going to get to play all sorts of different champions. As far as just guides, I mean, Dorky Diggity Dave had some back in the day about how to, like, deal with Spider-Man and that kind of stuff. But mostly, you're just going to have to play against champions to do that. I don't know if anyone has specific guides for how to beat or play around certain characters anymore these days. Um, yeah, they still it exist. Just comes from experience. What's that? They still exist. Um, yeah, you just have to do a, for older champs. A, I don't usually see anything new. You just have to search YouTube for you know that specific champ. Um, not every single champ is going to have a, a guide, but um, I would say another great way for learning how to fight annoying uh, champs is to watch Alliance War videos. Where, mm -hmm. um, you know, of course, people are trying to put the most annoying champs on defense. And, uh, yeah, you get some commentary there usually um, from the best of the best on you how they take down uh, those certain fights. Yeah, Lizer and Legacy and whatnot, yeah. Uh, some people suggesting unofficial Kabam Mike, yeah, or uh, Jason Voorhees does guides versus champs. Okay. I guess I just normally nowadays see more guides on how to use champions rather than how to um, fight champions. But so some some exist there. Some good suggestions from the chat. Thank you, guys. Sanskrit seconding Mr. Voorhees. Can't get five-star shards from Arena at, at his progression level unless he's got uncollected with a four-star, which is highly unlikely. Oh, I hate him. I think I'm in the middle of somebody else's conversation there. Wow, King Groot is so good looking at this gameplay. He stays topped up, that's for sure. Peppy Peppo MCOC? Don't know who that is. I'm gonna check it out. I just had three bowls of ice cream. Well, good for you. What flavor? Practice against your own champs with lower tier champs. You can always do that too. Yep. But I mean, if you need to, you, you might need to know how to do that first anyways. Otherwise you might just be, once you learn the strategy, then practicing is good, but you might need to learn the strategy or the tactics to use before practicing. Otherwise you're just going to bump your head against a wall. Is Iceman worth Awakening Gem? If you like him, he does get a lot of damage from being max sig these days. Uh, just depends uh, on. Wait, is he max sig? Your... What's that? Is he max sig? I thought it was just. What's it? What's his sig now? He he crits more with max sig, and that's how he gets um, his uh, the the frostbites or whatever is when he crits, right? So you want him to be max sig nowadays. Mm, okay. Dang, man, I forgot correctly? this guy is a stupid heal block, so I should not have brought King Groot for this one. Mm. Should've just like CGR'd his ass down or something. Mm -hmm. I'm not, oh, there we go, finally got the Vigilance buff. No, but I can't take advantage of it. Uh, yeah, I would, I would watch Lag's vids on uh, Ice Bro. He has some good vids and why he wants to be max sig or thing, so. It just really depends, though, because there's lots of other great mutant champions. Depends on yeah. if it's a generic gem you're talking about. Uh, I think the advice Brian always gives is what 
is it going to help you with as far as completing content? Will giving that Awakening Gem to that champion help you for your next progression level and that kind of stuff? Is it a better way to look at it rather than if the champion himself is worth it or not worth it? I'm just loving your face right now. <laughs> this, this super sad face <laughs> as you do this fight. It's fantastic. I had a lot of buffs, so I'm like, I don't have a Vigilance buff right now, but I'll probably gain one. So I just went for it, and of course I didn't get one. He doesn't crit more, his crits just have more chance to apply Frostbite. Okay, yeah, that's what it is, Derek. Thank you. Please die. Thank you, Derek. Thank you. Okay. All right, well, that's the last King Groot fight of the path, even though I probably could regen up if I really needed to, but um, let's use someone else for this one. And, of course, this is a great fight to use King Groot on. Son of a... So I want that permanent armor break. <laughs> Damn it, dude. Uh, CGR is faster anyways, though. I'll try CGR. I don't know if I've ever used CGR against Emma. Because... Doesn't that get a little annoying with uh, not being able to heavy? Yeah. You can have your after she's armor broken, though. And like two, two L2s, you should be just about done, probably. Plus, I can't remember if you have the distance if you dash back like short to heavy anyways. Mm, no idea. But I mean, now that she's armor broken, you can have your just fine. And oh, you dexed. <laughs> Ah. Whatever. She is going to die here. <laughs> so much faster than anything else you've been doing. King Grief, great for sustainability, but CGR, man. It's blazed through. I like to save items. Uh, um, the thing I is, I like to yeah, go fast. For sure. The thing is, I, it's just. Like, if I used them for. Like, look how much health I lost. I didn't get hit by anything. Yeah, what do you need them for? There's six fights. I know, but uh, I can only use them for like two or whatever. Three, maybe. Wait, you got a full roster of other champions. <laughs> okay. Uh, dang. Like, I think I still save Cersei. Because I don't, I don't think I could... I mean, using these cosmic champs here would be a nightmare. They have the Mystic Ascendancy. Yeah, you already got that. Kling for... Penny, so do that again. Yeah, let's just go with the penny route. You can uh, get it done, Kitty, again, too, if you just wanted to swap in. Um, I do. No, nah, I've, I've got all these nice cosmics. I'll just roll with this. Mm -hmm. It'll be fine. Slayer would be proud. No, he dexed. I saw it. <laughs> wow. Rat me proud. out. <laughs> he dexed. I saw it. <laughs> What's up, Dilithius? How you doing, man? King Groot is still faster than the old day fights of the Red Skull versus I can't remember. Oh, God, yeah. Those were for, took forever. Uh, how you doing, though, man? Good to see you. Listen, those are my favorite fights ever, okay? Uh-huh. Oh, Edwin, I remember, Edwin, you said something about... Uh, your rank 4 sig 200 ice man is almost a sure win when I ban warlocks. No regrets. Yeah, I don't have any regrets about me either. Watch out for for a ghost and and kingpin though. They will take him down very quickly in battlegrounds. He decks when he already had the precision buff and hadn't reset the cycle, so it didn't matter. Okay, Philip. Okay. Okay. Venom versus Red School. What's up, MSD? You back? MSD, were you here earlier when Brian got his butt kicked by your uh, your boy um, Red Gobby? <laughs> it's not fun. Don't intercept, Brian. Yeah, good point. Oh, intercept. Yeah. Okay. Foresight, speed things up. Dilly dilly. There we go. I got the foresight with special two for a part of it at least. Nice. Only one crit, though. 
I was on the other side of the screen, silly. Oh, oh that was you trolling him. That's that's how he lost to that uh, red goblin. Gotcha, MST. Makes sense. <laughs> how you doing, Royal? What's going on? Royal, you were saying you thought you're going to make it to the meetup in Vancouver, right? I think. Um, I made a Discord server, and I'll make a video soon about that so that people can chat about that, Royal. MSD is here. You know what that means? Joke time? Mm, easy. No. <laughs> We're all here. What's up, Haley? How you doing? Uh, yes, I'm definitely gonna be there. Okay, yeah, Royal. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna make a video hopefully sometime soon here about the meetup a little bit, and um, we'll have that Discord server so people can communicate if they're gonna be there, kind of get an idea of who's gonna go and coordinating things. I honestly don't know exactly how much we're gonna need to coordinate stuff outside of Kabam, because. I assume they're going to have two places for those things, and that'll be afternoon or evening. So people wanting to go out afterwards, sure, but I don't know if we'll actually need to like reserve a venue or anything to do it separately since the meetup will be there. Uh, what's up, Torrance? How's it going? Sip. Okay, Penny down. Moving on. But MSD loves jokes, and we want him to feel welcome. We do want to include, yeah, in MSD. That's true. Do people laugh out loud in Hawaii? Or is it a low ha? <sighs> Thanks, MSD. <laughs> MSD, uh, I would send you for a lap, but you're really into fitness, and I feel like you would enjoy that, so maybe just... Take a seat. <laughs> Probably doing some jumping jacks and or uh, pull ups and muscle ups or something right now, you know. Stop um, doing homework. <laughs> yeah. Stop being intelligent. Uh, <laughs> all right. Let's see here. Weapon node dark hold pages. Whenever the defender crits or hits into the attacker's block, they inflict a staggered debuff for 10 seconds. If these staggers nullify a buff, they deal a burst of direct damage um okay 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 so it's when the defender crits or it's in the block okay um okay so probably not bringing in cosmic champs excuse me for this one disarm uh intercept okay and then capture special two knockdown also okay uh, combat deja vu, unblockable whenever the attacker lands the same uh, type basic attack in a row. The defender gains an unblockable buff. Okay. And then Mystic Ward as well. Alright. Um, right off the top of my head, I'm thinking I'm bringing Kingpin, Hulk, mm -hmm. um, Doom. Titania. Yeah, Doom. I, I do see a, uh, an Annihilus there. You could use Nick. I kind of want to bring in Torch, but I don't know. I'll probably bring Torch. Maybe Void. Eye bomb. <laughs> oh, I should bring Void, yeah. Jugs. All right. Mm. Let's select the team here. All right, I'll stop reading. <laughs> what are Thank the dates you. for the MCU? <laughs> what, are the, what are the dates for the MCOC meetup in Vancouver? Uh, the boss. It's October 20th and 21st, I believe, Friday and Saturday. Oh, maybe she brings spot. Brian is 100% going, as I will announce in my video. I don't know if I'll be there. If, if Brian doesn't go, I will bring a cardboard cutout of Brian with me so that people can still take pictures. Wow. Are those, are those expensive? You might be committing to something that uh, <laughs> could get pretty expensive there. I don't know. I haven't looked into it. You can pay for it. Oh, yeah. Great. I'll get right on Cause, that. Because you, you're you're, you'd you're you be the one who wouldn't be showing up and you'd be disappointing all of your 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 hundred and nearly 60,000 fans and uh, by not showing up. So I'm pretty sure you could you could cover the cost. Oh, uh, these people aren't fans. They're just here to get a discount on the bald caps. But I'm done doing those giveaways. 
Uh, Alright, what do I want to... <sighs> Is Doom going to be... Yeah, Doom will be good. Um... Someone should do a Titania cosplay, then Brian will come for sure. Mm hmm. Maybe this is just fine enough for the team. Who else? What were they going to bring? I could have sworn there was one other champ that we were talking about. Should I bring Absorbing Man instead of Doom? Um, who else? Is Absorbing Man sturdier? Mm. I'm going to be intercepting anyway. Oh, we uh, mentioned like you could do Nick. And that synergy, but then that's two spots. But Nick would be good for the path, I think. Anyways. Yeah, I don't want to do that. Screw him. I want to bring wow. up Zori Man, get more used to using him instead of Doom. Practice him a bit, yeah. Yeah. I'm going to run with this. Oh, I Bomb is who I was going to bring to. I was told yesterday that there was going to be a 90% sale on bog caps. 90% sale? Oh, my God. I mean, that'd be if he was going out of business. And obviously, his business is so good, there's no way that's a 90% sale. Ridiculous. I'm going to bring an eye bomb instead of torch and hope that it doesn't bite me. Let's do yeah, that. it should be good. Okay. Let's roll out. Brian playing Diablo or what? Chris? Uh, Diablo 4 you're talking about? No. Yeah, he's playing Diablo when we play Halo, Chris. It's a Reddit for play Fall Guys. Somebody else. <laughs> I guess I'll start with Kingpin on this. Uh, how you doing, though, buddy? BG is cosplaying as Kingpin. Lags is going as Starkey. Well, I think Lags goes Torch, but yeah, maybe Starkey. Karate Man is Herc, obviously, and Abdo, I don't know yet. I could be Abs Man? Oh, yeah, yeah, we have the exact same body type, so for sure. I'll play Halo when BG plays Elden Ring. How is you and me, you and playing Halo, contingent on this dingus doing something? It's just never going to work out. Uh, Samwise sending over a dollar. Thank you, Samwise. Your last was, I never got my bald cap. So because of that, here's a joke. What did Black Widow say to Hawkeye? You make me quiver. Oh my God, dude. Uh, really? I forgot about the unstoppable. Oh, every time. And this is why he's good in, uh, as a defender sometimes. Whoops. Oof. <laughs> At least he didn't kill you with that L2. That's a plus. Yeah, but do I restart the path? Do I just keep going? It is the first fight, right? It is, but I'm a little. Everybody wild. loves. Everybody loves more content. You know, it's not like I have dinner plans. Anything, I'll so. keep going. I'll just keep going. <laughs> uh, boo, Samwise. I hate to send you for a lap, but that was particularly bad. Boo. Uh, yeah, please. Get out of here. Martin, Ooh. also sending over a loony. I have a feeling this is going to be a joke. That was Martin's last. When did the guy leave the... When did the guy leave the wig shop empty-handed? Wouldn't that be a why, Martin? Um, because he forgot to pay. Boo. Martin, one of the worst offenders of terrible jokes. Boo. 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 Oh, God, I just... Take a lap. Redo it. You finished the fight quickly. Yeah, that was pretty quick. Power drain. Well, that's not very nice. It's not. Ryan will play Elden Ring when the DLC comes out next year. <laughs> A power drain um, again? Come on. Rude. Stop power draining me. I'm trying to... Like, I just want to kill you. Why don't you let me kill you? <laughs> uh, kind of hard to stun lock if you got no power. <laughs> and the unblockable, not helping. Dementia. Dementia, go back to sleep. We've been asleep for like three hours, dude. What are you doing? What's up, BG and chat? Thanks. Uh, thank the Lord the arena botters are gone. I overshot by heaps and got spot 68. Went off the best number. Yep. Yeah, and Dementia got to 500 subscribers, too, which is awesome. Congratulations. Hey, um, congrats. 
That is very awesome. But he got himself a Danny Moonstar and, and way overshot. Hmm. Did you even sleep, bro? Are you eating though? Yeah. Uh, no, dude, he's been asleep for like three hours. Couldn't, couldn't have been. Uh, this damage that I'm taking, I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. Let's continue on though. Four fights more on the path. Sleep is useless. Yeah, I highly disagree. Flash, what's up, dude? Martin T, are you sending over another one? Really? What do you call a bald porcupine? Pointless. It's like he's got a book or something. He couldn't have had time to take his lap before getting back to That's give it other I'm terrible saying, joke. dude. Like, this is... This is not cool, man. You need to... The, 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 the punishment fits the crime, and uh, now you're going to have to go for, like, four or five, ten laps or something. I don't know, dude. It's... It's just getting silly. Come on, pal. Throw it quick so I can get my special two and capture your weapon. Thank you very much. This path is pretty cool. Um, I think this is the intercept path that... Well, I can't remember who said they liked it. But... Um, I'm also still taking a bunch of damage on it, so... Kind of scary. Come on, please throw your special one. Don't waste all my capture time. Still been kind of half ass grinding the side quest here. Mm -hmm. uh, you're doing this to yourself, Brian, because the more laps you take, the healthier they'll get, and the longer they'll be around to tell jokes. Well, you know what? MSD really has a point with that one. Oh, uh, what's up, Sanskrit? I also. Maybe they'll learn their lesson after a while. Because, like. <laughs> I do want people to be around, it's just not in that kind of way. Mm -hmm. Well, you want them to be around, you don't want them to be round, because if they do enough laps, then they'll not no. be... No, 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 no. Oh crap, I just did it, sorry. You're not sorry, I feel like. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking about it, and I'm like, oh, damn. If I just go for it here, I'm going for it. Uh, I should have went for it, why least... did I go for it? <laughs> oh my god, please, doesn't die. <laughs> why aren't you dying? What's going on? It's because <laughs> he has 10 heat charges. <laughs> uh, is he not going to throw it, though? Is he not going to throw it? No. Oh. He gave you a hope. The old classic... Only throw it when there's 2% left. <sighs> Lovely. Lovely. Um... <laughs> hey, well, he won't have all those heat charges when you start out this way time, so that's fine. Uh, Sanskrit saying, it's official. Paradox is my least favorite part of the game ever. Dex to remove them with this AI. Oh, dude, I cannot... I just... The baiting lately has been been an issue for sure. Mm, Samwise sending over another dollar. <sighs> what else did Samwise say? Why were the Avengers fighting blind after Infinity War? <sighs> they lost their vision. Boo. Boo. Spoilers. Boo. Take a lap. T Pizzle. Thank you for the buck. Say so, it was me, BG, and I'm just in time to see you crushing it. I thought it was you. Um, I was pretty sure it was you. 
Uh, T Pizzle, thank you very much, dude. I I may I was crushing it a little bit, and then I got crushed. So, uh, we'll see how it finishes. Martin T, thank you for another loony saying what? No, no. Why is there a lot of controversy about the bald man's will? Turns out he didn't have any heirs. Okay, yep. Cool. Uh huh. Okay, mm -hmm. really great stuff. We should maybe go on a, a, a field trip and just all take a lap together at this point. <laughs> all right, um, I'm going to use Absorbing Man for this. Um, should I use the, the s second one at all? Maybe I should. Yeah, oh. I, I'm going to use Magma. I don't know if this is smart or stupid or what, but that's what I'm going to do. I don't know enough either. Yeah, experiment a little. Maybe I'll learn a little something. What do you mean spoilers? Infinity War came out like six years ago? Uh, Cade Bond, that's what we call Starcasm. That was a great joke. Don't encourage him, Jay Fury. How you doing today? Haha, <clears throat> <laughs> love it, Martin T. I mean, I'm, you know, I'm, I, uh, I love Martin. Don't love the jokes. I do love that Samwise is at oh, least no. trying to make his terrible jokes Marvel related. So there's that's I appreciate that, but also don't love the jokes. I think I was supposed to heavy attack. Whoops. You're supposed to heavy to get more damage. Yeah. Yeah, yeah crit. Yeah. Nice light intercept though. Yeah, no, no, no. Oh, good. Don't spoil me, Titanic, please. Spoilers, there was enough room on that raft. She was just awful. <laughs> I'll be here all night. Oh, Martin. Yeah. It's Father's Day. We deserve jokes, even if I'm not a father. I mean, dad jokes are kind of appropriate for Father's Day, but I don't want to encourage that. You didn't uh, like my banner one last night? I didn't. You snuck it in. You just you snuck it in so well. Ugh, was, I'm totally going and reading a tweet, looking at a tweet. Congratulations, your seven-star bishop. Sneaking into that. Just terrible. Hanging in there. Hope you're good as well, Abdo, and your dog. She's had some treats already, so she's passed out. She did okay. I'm chilling. I just had a second double espresso, though, so I might be a little more wired now. i to going to have some food here at some point. Which Marvel character is ready for the summer? Tan Os. Oh, Samwise. Oh, thank you for another dollar, Samwise. Boo. Tan Os. Oh, jeez. Um. Oh, I was expecting her to gash backwards. No, I'm so screwed. Oops. Mm, what's up, Blizzard? Is the Mystic Pole still happening today? Not sure. Dad jokes in Dad's day. This is paradise. Maxi. Oh, God. Was it supposed to be today? Did Kabam mess up again? They wouldn't do that. They've not messed up a pole ever. Didn't we have to do the Mystic one? That's where they messed up the Claire thing, right? Yeah, but they were gonna. They said they they'd bring it. Oh, back. they were gonna redo it for. God. They've messed up and deleted these polls like three or four times now. I swear. I'm just. I'm just saying. Like I. It's not important compared to the bugs in the game at all. But goddamn, can they just get someone to proofread things? Because every single survey, every single poll, their their email message about. Uh, this is a stream you want to miss. <laughs> you, you'll you'll want to miss this stream. <laughs> like just 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 rupee <laughs> sex twice, guys. What are you doing? Yeah. Like it shouldn't be this hard. There are these just unforced errors. Looks like Mystic was supposed to be today, June eighteenth. So I don't know what happened. Um, maybe they accidentally messed up the the scheduled tweet because it is Sunday after all. So I imagine uh, whoever sets it up is not. Uh, in the office right now. They can't set that from home? Or they can't set it up on Friday to go? No, that's what I'm saying. I'm saying they, they probably messed up the, um, <sighs> the, the schedule. Right? 
I mean, there's plenty of time before the crystals come out, so it doesn't really matter. But still, it's just like the, the silly little things. You're just like, come on, man. Abby, don't read last. You keep missing it. No, we're not reading any more lasts. What'd you say, Chris? Abby, what do you call? But no, no, you didn't send over a super chat. I'm not reading that joke. Get out of here. <laughs> if I, if you don't send a super chat and I accidentally read your joke, that's one thing. I'm definitely not going back to read last for a lousy joke. Love you, Chris. Not happening. <laughs> Little Mace, what's up? Oh, maybe they accidentally put Doom in the poll and just decided to cancel it entirely. Could be, Blizzard, could be. Mm. Is it wise to try fully explore Act 6 as you're progressing to Thronebreaker? No, Subi. I'd say progress as far as you can before going back and completing that. Um, Act 7 and Act 8 are kind of easier. I mean, they, they nerfed Act 6 anyways, but you, I would... I would try to push to the next progression level rather than 100% Act 6. Come on. Oh, jeez. I'm so screwed. Yeah, yeah. Very screwed here. Nice. Samwise with another dollar. <clears throat> Thank you, Samwise. Okay, this one BG may appreciate. I doubt it. In the next movie, the Avengers will battle media conglomerate Comcast. <sighs> It will be called Xfinity War. I mean, Xfinity deserves to be taken down. But boo, no, that was still bad. So anyway, I'm gonna do this fight now. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm uh, failing I'm my intercepts against this guy so hard. And there's the stun, and there's the special one. I'd be getting hit by his unblock oh my while one God. Now, so. I cannot Dude. stop failing intercepts with this guy. Oh, and there, okay, there's the stun again. Yeah, 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 okay. Well, yeah, you're, you know, the stuns are screwed, so. Yeah, I'm pretty screwed here. I love that his mask off about only reading super chats. Uh, for jokes, I, I read all sorts of other comments, but if you, if you want me to read last, A, I don't want to do no reading last, there's 500 people in here you can copy and paste. And B, if you want me to read last for a bad joke, no, get out of here. Like, by the rules of the internet, if you super chat, it must be read. That's how these things go, as long as it's not hateful or, you know, whatever. But going, no, 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 no. Yeah, don't, don't do the <sighs> no. read last thing, please, guys. Don't do that. Uh, just send the message again in a non-spammy way. Yeah, yeah, I mean, I wasn't really complaining that much about that. I'm just saying, like, I, I know, I'm, I'm just saying, mask it though, off or honesty, uh, or uh, yeah, I'm, I'm honestly not going back to read bad jokes. Hell no. But speaking of super chats, there's a couple here. You want to get to these, or you want to fight? Yay! Let me go ahead and read them. Um, let me see this one from Andrew Field with the twelve a, yeah. months. Um, thank you, dude. The one year saying, "Hey, BG, been having lots of fun with my six star rank for Danny." Dang. Six star rank four. Uh, she's always banned in battlegrounds. Makes sense, dude. She's so fast. Uh, that's awesome, though, dude. Congrats on the uh, new too. Congrats the, on getting the, her injured. Yeah, the rank four. She's super fun. One of my favorites of the year for sure. Uh, ah. Agent Bull, thank you for the five saying. Why did this snowman go in the vegetable garden? He was picking his nose. Okay, that's. Really funny. Thank you for the five. This is why I'm laughing so hard because it's so funny. Enjoy your lap. Uh, Martin T, thank you for literally saying the Avengers Force Black Widow. Abby, do I blame you for this? You're saying at least they made it about Marvel and now these Marvel, they're twice as bad. The Avengers Force Black Widow to turn her, her GPS on because she is always roaming off. Okay. Is that the last one, Martin T? Thank you. Thank you for another. <laughs> I had to buck. mute the mic. I actually laughed at that one. <laughs> uh, why? 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 Do you... Okay. Because it's, it's Marvel related. It's clever. I don't know. Clever. Romanoff. It's it's a good one. Yeah. I, I'm like, I understood that reference. You know. Everybody did. That's why the jokes are terrible. <laughs> Oh, uh, boy. 
How much has he got done? I just got here. Uh, he's on his fourth path, right? Uh, this will be two number more five. Or oh, five, yes. Yeah, so just one more to go after this one. Yeah, this is the end of the fifth path. We're getting there. We're getting there. Wet noodle. What's up? The Bayman showed and proved they have no respect for the player base. They won't do anything on a Sunday, just like they're the only gaming company I've ever seen do maintenance during prime time. I don't think that's true. I uh, disagree with that. I Listen, I I think the band makes uh, plenty of mistakes, but... Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't think they have no uh, respect for the player base. Yeah, and also, when's the last time they even did maintenance? Plus, maintenance yeah. usually happens... Uh, I don't know. Like I, I see maintenance happening on Tuesdays all the time. Uh, well, that's kind more, of their... I'm wondering. We've somebody had pointed out that we haven't seen the regular Tuesday maintenance like we used to always have, um, and maybe that's why there's so many more bugs. But yeah, and, and also talking about a gaming company doing maintenance during prime time. Well, for who? This game gets played all over the world. So just because it's prime time for you or maybe certain people doesn't mean it's prime time for other people. You know. Yeah, I think it's totally fair to critique Kabam, but uh, we got to keep the critiques oh, yeah. reasonable, at least I would say. Uh, otherwise, it just sounds like, you know, complain about stuff that, uh, um, you know, like that, that's all you do is yeah. complain, you know. Um, all right, let's see here. So Cersei is... Uh, on the list. I'm gonna fight Cersei this time. Watch the next path be like the perfect Cersei counter team that I bring anyway, but whatever. I want to get rid of this fight. So uh, mm -hmm. I guess I guess I'll bring in my Doom. I'll replace Hulk with Doom. Let's um... Let's Messiah that. said he had no problem with Doom with this fight, so... I would feel like Jugs would be fine too, right? I have no idea. I don't really know how that guy works. Well, you can heavy and stagger her from getting the buffs, but if she gets off the oh. first heavy, then you're probably posed. Oh. You're not running MD, too, so remember that. Yeah. Should I not be bringing in Doom, then? No, I mean, I'd probably bring him as backup. Just be aware that, you know, it might not get quite as much power as you want. I'm scared of this fight. I hope don't be void, scared. I hope void just works and that's it. You only got to do it once. If void doesn't work, then at least you're showing the people. Yeah, I, you know, that's the majority of my gameplay is uh, demonstrating for people what not to do. Oh, you don't got to tell me I've seen your gameplay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, that's why I will be going to the meetup, but not caring about the tournament. <laughs> Top eight in battlegrounds. Uh, no way. It's pretty rough. I want to see if legs legs can do it though. I I believe in I believe in our boy there. He can he can do it. Uh, get to top eight. He's been close. I think he said in his video he was like. A, 11th or 12th or 10th and 11th couple of the, of the first seasons so um yeah i'd love to see lags be able to make it to that top eight and then also get to go there in vancouver and, and meet up and everything yeah be sick all right i'm getting terrible rng with my petrifies but there's one finally what's up bottom deb roy by the way how's it going the mcoc fan eclipse little mace i think i said hi little mace Mosin ul Hak no, no. Hunikar. I'm sorry if I just totally butchered your name. How you doing? What is tiebreaker for some points in Gladiator Circuit? Usually if you have the exact same points, I think it's supposed to be a draw, isn't it? I think it might be something under the hood of like, you know, yeah. down to milliseconds or something like that. Or I don't know. I'm not too sure, to be honest. No, come on. And that, Abdo, we love you. I mean, I just, I try to, yeah. Man of the people. That MFing boy knows. Keep dexing and not registering. What's up, Atrasis? How you doing? Oh, I Did you to... get is... Oh, God, I forgot. I have to hit her to get rid of this buff so that I can... Oh, Jesus, no. Why'd I do that? Okay, whatever. You're reducing your ability accuracy or something? 
or just input issues in general? Oh, well, that time I, I just threw my striker in at the very wrong time. But, yeah, I don't know. I, oh, well, that's that's my fault, too, there, for sure. I... Um, I was having a hard time dexing some of these attacks. Hey. You should have not talking about their ranking, not the fight score. Easy. Uh, I don't know. I'm not sure if that was. I thought. I assume they meant the fight score. But as far as the ranking goes, well, it, it's you know points based. So I don't think you'd. And well, I mean, you could end up with the exact same points for eighth or something. But I don't know. I don't know what the would be. The, what you do in that situation? See, that time that was a dex. Why did I not dex? I thought it was top 10. June Buggy, it's, uh, they said top 8. Um, I cannot dex her. This there. is insane, man. I, I'm definitely dexing. It's just not actually... My character's not moving out of the way. That's frustrating as hell. Yeah. You'd say that's irritating? Like, I, I, it's the only thing I'm waiting for. I'm, I'm not trying to do a different action there. I'm mm -hmm. thumb on the phone ready to, ready to dex. And... Uh, yeah, just can't do it. I just wanted to just say that's irritating for Easy's sake. He loves it when I say like that. that. Points it out. Points it out every time. <laughs> uh. Uh, you tried well. I was talking about GC ranking system tiebreaker. Yeah, okay. Uh, I don't know then. Uh, most of them, they, they oh. would have to have some way of doing that, but I don't think that's been announced. Um, probably it might be one of those things that if it, they wouldn't announce it or deal with it unless that situation came up. I think I'm actually good for this. I'm starting to have some doubts. Like I'm just you're healing glancing her. everything? She's just healing. This is, I think I'm just gonna quit out, honestly. Uh, this feels wasteful. Mm. Yeah, maybe not. I, don't, I feel like I, I maybe do need MD. Yeah. Um, is BG, BG dropping frames, or is it just me? Um, no frames also drops. It's not, also, it's not you, BG. The game's controls are still screwed. What's up, Fitzy? How you doing? Yeah, I'm just intentionally kind of dying here. She's just healing up. Yeah. Uh, I think she was down like 55%, so... It's pretty rough because I have recoils in void, so you might actually have to use potions. Oh my god, sounds terrible. Uh, it is terrible, man. <laughs> is absorbing man good against Cersei, or is this bad? Well, he makes all the debuffs like decrease their duration by ninety percent, right? So. I would think he would be, but I don't know if I've ever done it. I'm gonna try. Just parry, parry heavy, no other attacks? Were you talking about with Dune, or are you talking uh, about Doom, or are you talking about Asmam? Is that what I was supposed to do with, with Doom? Hmm. I hate relying on parry in this game these days, with your input issues and so forth. Where I'm saying Asmam is good for Cersei. Let's try it. Mm. Not all unblockable, unstoppable immortality with Avsman. Oh, I thought he reduced the duration of all buffs. No? Oh, yeah, okay. So that glance and the heal, they're going through just fine. How does the Hulk feel when he wears a suit? S smashing. Okay, I'm done. Boo. Damn it, Martin, I was accidentally reading that one before you even sent over the loony. I'm sure BG thanks you for the loony and for your Marvel-related joke. She just threw that special mid-combo right there. That was fun. Yep. Why? God, it's so tiresome that they do that. Yeah, because you weren't going slow or anything. She's just like, hey, you're in the middle of your combo. I got a special. Let me use it. Sweet. I think that kind of relates to sometimes champions have been using their specials 
like they're L3 before they actually have the three bars of power showing. So that's been a complaint that people have made too. Mm. Um, resetting the game after lag helps a lot when it starts to lag at champ select. I know it's time to reset the game. Yeah, he just reset relatively recently too. Light intercepts on point. Not bad, not bad. No. Oh, we're not point that time. Reap. Um, wasn't too bad. I get, I. Hmm. I guess I'll do that again. My bad, Abdo. Season ten, not ten summoners. Oh yeah, that's the season that's gonna count for it, June buggy. Watch mm. heal pots yeah, Subi, here. uh, let it go. We don't need any drama between anybody, please. I have noticed on the odd occasion the AI getting those ultra quick blocks against specials again. Yep. The the reaction time seems weird. And I don't know if it's the frame rate. I don't know, because you know, other animations been messed up and stuff too. Um, yeah. Was waiting for him to throw medium light medium. Oh, right. Are you supposed to medium light medium with Abs Man to get more charges or something? Yeah, I, I was gonna medium light medium. I was just trying to get a good opportunity. Hmm. I didn't have 150 charges for that long in the fight, and now I just died trying to explain that. Damn it. <laughs> uh, whoops. <laughs> Let's try again. Mm, chat GPT controls Kabam AI. <laughs> it's, it's learning, it's getting smarter. <laughs> Animations seem really fast this month. They've they've seemed off for a while. They've seemed off since the beginning of the year, honestly. Overall, I don't know. It's it's kind of we all we all kind of just adapt to how the game is, whatever state it's at at the moment, and just keep playing. Or we say, screw Kabam, this isn't worth it. They're not getting any more of my money. I give up. I play a different game. So just depends. Very heavy with doom was what you're saying okay i pulled a seven star gambit what's up swan and a four star gambit relic a day later had no idea how good the relic was till bg's video thanks one of my most powerful champs with the relic three to four hundred thousand special twos wow oh, crazy swanny dang Definitely the frame rate, the game skips and eats inputs. It's just so massive now, probably eats a ton of RAM. Yeah, it could be. Does BG have a ranked up long shot? I do not believe so. Nope. He's not redoing this fight anyway, so it doesn't matter though, if you, that's why you're asking. Should probably take up Kingpin to rank four for Bahamut BG. Uh, yeah, we talked about that a little bit the other day. Might be an option, not sure though. You just take up being pinned to rank four anyways, because he feels much better at rank four than rank three. I he's one that I just definitely noticed the the difference. Yay, finally a stream where I don't have to listen to Abdo Blab. What's up, Oog? How you doing? Uh Uh, Aegon Samuel saying, Hey BG, love your content and your humor. You give great tips on the game as a free to play player and aspire to have your success in the game. And he, and he aspires to have your success in the game. All love. That's a very kind message, Aegon. Oh, thanks, man. Hmm. No, please. No, I'm going to die here. No, maybe not.
Yeah, that sequence was all wrong. Uh, I never really worried about ending with a medium before, but now I don't ever want to end a combo with a medium. The AI just reacts too fast. It does feel like that sometimes, yeah. Kingpin feels better at rank 5, I'll bet. Cersei, I can do this all day. Yeah, Cer Cersei. Cap Captain Cersei. Cersei. Okay. Well, don't have to go through that fight again next time. Jeez. That is uh, an annoying fight. Mm hmm. But you're done, so it's all good. Yeah. And one more path to go. One more path to go. Hopefully, a fairly quick one. Let's see. So, it is reinvigorated unblockable one. Every time a regeneration buffer passes is activated, if the defender is not under a heal block effect, they gain a dormant vigor charge. Once we got 10, okay. Um, aggression regen, okay. Oh, see, this was the void path right here. Uh, retaliate whenever the attacker blocks a hit from the defender's uh, special attacks. The attacker gains a fury buff. All right, indomitable. Oh, never mind. It's not the void path. Um, okay. I kind of want to bring Howard. I just have to be pretty cautious of uh, the unblockable because they will go unblockable. I don't think I can really stop him from doing that. But he's got the heal block on the special one. And yeah be fun um uh, let's see i'll probably put warlock on the team just for that um mr sinister let's do that hmm okay i don't think i'm gonna go too hard on like an actual heal block team, but maybe that's stupid of me to be thinking that way. Uh, Sorry, I'm not paying attention. <laughs> oh no, it's all good. Text my dad, see if we're doing dinner or whatever tomorrow. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. cool. I think... Hmm. What do I want to do? What do I want to do? I mean, does Archangel's thing count as heal block? Oh, probably has to be an active one. That's what I'm thinking. What? I'm not sure. What are you doing? Yeah, I mean, Warlock? Oh, you already put him on the team. Yeah. Look up. I'll put Howard in here. I'll just put King Groot. It's got a little, little crib buff there. All right, I'm just gonna roll with this. Let's go. AA's Nero's heal block when awakened. Yeah, does it count? The the I'm not sure if it counts for this note. Is is the question though? Yeah, I would think it wouldn't. Um, no rocket. Oh, the defender. Where? Yeah, actually, rocket would be good for this, right? Well, the recoils is kind of the problem with him. Well, that's true. Yeah. Uh, crud. Where does it say if the defender is not under a heal block effect? Well, it's just a heal block effect. A so works. It's, it's a a hmm. should work actually. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um. Omega right. Sentinel works great with the Vision Relic. Yeah, I'm sure I probably used Omega Sentinel for all those. Maybe I will put AA on the team real quick then. Yeah. What do I cut? Maybe Kingpin? I don't really need him. Well, he's not going to be heal blocking. No, he's not. almost want a Horseman AA. 
but that's yeah, but then you got to do a fight with many. a park. Yeah, I wouldn't need cable synergy though. Hmm, is there a mutant first one or something? Or yeah, Saberman. Hmm, it's a little tempting actually. That's a little tempting actually. You know what? I mean, I never do it. Uh, Restart. Who do I take out? Maybe King Groot? Let's do that. Yeah. Mm. Uh, I restart yeah. again. All right. What's up, BG? King Golden 95 YT saying hi. What's up? Did it? It's not hard. Got gotcha, you, Marlin. All right. Let's roll. So we APOC this first one, and then you're going to make AA Horseman. I normally don't worry about using uh, Horseman AA because the dude's already so strong, he doesn't need any help. But with recoils, if I want to use him for multiple fights, I yeah, I kind of need him to not... It's nice, it definitely helps. Yeah... Plus, I mean, it's always just nice to have that horseman ability. Like, if you screw up a parry or something, especially with uh, AA, since you're parrying heavy all the time, that sure. just goes unstoppable and whatnot. Yeah. It's a little safety net. Mm hmm. Let's refresh these. Oh, oh, oh. Let's check a special two now. I start uh, just naming champs, Aegon. Are you asking for rank up advice? Hey, BG, when you complete 8.2, is Hulk going to rank two then? Oh, uh, I think I'll be short on the tier six catalyst. I think I'll be one catalyst short, I believe. So nice. I can't Pick up do the offer. <laughs> oh, that's not going to happen. Screw that offer. <laughs> Yeah, that was um, a joke. So it won't happen immediately, but that is what I'm building towards. Yeah. I am a little worried that he's just going to catch so many bands in Battlegrounds, though. I feel like uh, I'll never get know, to play him again. He's one of those ones, though, I feel like I, he does my my mine does get banned a lot. But if somebody has Hulk in their deck, they're not going to want to ban him usually. Um, mm -hmm. And he's not awakened, so he's not as a uh, defensive threat, really. Rob saying R2 Hulk is sick and he doesn't get banned for me. Interesting. Yeah, because my rank 5 gets banned a pretty decent amount of the time. If they're gonna, if people are going to ban my nuke options that are in my deck, they ban Torch, AA, and, and Hulk, usually. I'm just thinking, like... I could see him not getting banned for a lot of people because he's not the most OP champ in the game or anything. God, this is nice. Oh, really? Did you OP. have to hit me? Um, it, uh, no, yeah, he's, he's strong and everything. It's just that there are stronger champs and, um, if you have other champs that are like of similar rank, uh, I could totally see wanting to ban those champs instead, but mm -hmm. I I don't really have other champs of similar rank. I'm gonna Howard this one. That's uh, true, but you. That, that's a good point. He's gonna be head and shoulders above everyone else. I I just think that he's gonna be so much fun and so good anyways for just general questing and other different stuff that I would still take him up. Yeah. Oh, I guess even. Just 10 stacks of, um, or not 10 stacks, but like maxing out, uh, what's it called here works as a heal block, uh, despair. Yeah. So, okay. 
Yeah, I assume that's why you brought Hulk for this, actually. Yeah, I, well, I didn't think it was going to prevent the unblockable, um, but I knew I could prevent healing well mm -hmm. enough and uh, just like stun lock finish. His damage is so high. Oh, wait, no, there's the unblockable. How did I prevent it then? I'm not sure what's happening. Rank five Hulk insta ban. He he gets banned a decent amount, but when he sneaks through, oh man, he's fun. Abby, do we be grinding for Danny Moonstar next round? I'm thinking about it, Hodges. I am I'm thinking about it. So I might wake up and pop on dream at 10 a.m. or 11, like do the first couple fights, and, uh, get on the streak somewhere around there. I'm thinking about it. I haven't done a grind for quite a long time, so maybe. You said AA didn't need help as a horseman, but you had 13 neuros. Yeah, it's not a bad amount, huh? Well, that's, that was the help of the horseman right there. Mm-hmm. Because he increases ability accuracy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, so he doesn't need it, but yeah, it doesn't hurt. That's for sure. Uh, uh, or never mind. I, I'm sorry. I'm understanding the message now. I Whoops. My bad. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Um, this one's going to suck. This would be really a lousy fight for Hulk. This is going to be a lousy fight for anybody. Champs. I guess I'm going to use yeah. Warlock. Warlock? Yeah. yeah. It'll be slow, but safe. Yeah. Because worst case, I could take that um, uh, Sinister with someone else after. Yeah, A would be fine. He doesn't throw back the Neuro, right? Doesn't throw back the Neuro, or he doesn't throw back Heal Block on uh, Howard. So either way, I'll be fine. Oh, whoops. Oh, my God. <laughs> right when you said that, I was getting a hit by a spider pig heavy. So I'm like, yep, whoops. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Lined up exactly with, like, my whoops at the same time. Why is he... Oh, wait, no. Yeah, why? What the heck is that? I had... He shouldn't have been able to heal there. So why... And of course, I get hit by that because I'm an idiot. I'm maybe not understanding this node entirely. I mean, he's not actually healing. I think it's that he still but, got the buff and that caused him to be unblockable. Right? No, he shouldn't be gaining no. those because of the... Let me read this node. Let me see. Uh, so we'll every like time a <laughs> regen buff or passive is activated, if the defender is not under a heal block effect, they gain a dormant vigor charge. Yeah, so he shouldn't be gaining those charges. Because mm. he, he should have no way to reach 10 to go unblockable on me. That's... Well, at least that certainly, couldn't be a, certainly couldn't be a bug. Or, I mean, I wonder if it's at all with this guy. Because doesn't this guy mess with ability accuracy and stuff? Warlock doesn't heal block, he heal prevents. Uh, maybe it's something about the interaction. I mean, I'm preventing him most of the time. I don't know. Whatever. Let me just try to get through the rest of this fight. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it with Warlock alone, but I need to get him as low as possible. Is Warlock special 2 based? I play him as L2 based. I mean, that's usually you want to go for the, the L2, yeah. Yeah. But the armor breaks aren't going to stick for uh, no, Taskmaster he's, here. He's debuff immune at the moment. Mm -hmm. Infection messing with AAR? Maybe. Like, similarly to uh, mm. the way that Assassin messes it up? That could be. I don't think that's the case with this one, but I, I'm not sure. Mm, yeah. He's still getting the regen buff because of aggressive regen. Hmm. Yeah, but it's just why he. It shouldn't. It doesn't matter that he's gaining it. He's blocked, and the it says if you have a heal block. If you block it, it'll yeah. gain the charge. So. 
I might make it through here, actually. You can hate fighting Trash Master. Yep. If you ever come up against Kanga Janga, you, you block his rank five Taskmaster, that's for sure. <laughs> Let's see. Ban him. 8%. I'm not going to do that on a special three, I don't think. No, I didn't. But if I bait this. Oh, five foot combo was not enough, but an intercept and two combo will be. Sweet. Well, now I can swap out Warlock at the end if need be. And a couple fights left. Alright, so I think I'm... Should I mean, should I use... I guess I should use AA for this, you know. Let's do it. I did want to bring him for a reason. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Ryan... Danny Grindstream, a new account stream, Abdo. Uh, you gotta keep us member, all us members entertained. <laughs> There's like hundreds of us now. Yeah. Uh, it is? Oh, shoot, dude, I forget what, are, what our count is at. I did the math, though, the other day, because uh, this, this isn't even like a humble brag, but because of people going crazy with the gift memberships, is something like 7% of my channel <laughs> members. Dang. Just because of the the low the low subscriber count to, to member ratio, that was pretty awesome, man. People people be awesome. Yeah, we're up to uh, one one thirty seven uh, total members at the moment. Those, of course, like a hundred of those are gifted. So in a month's time, they're all gonna go away, and I'm gonna be very sad. But for the meantime, it's pretty darn fun. You guys have been super generous lately. That was cool. Yeah, I, I love I love the gift of membership because it in, it includes everybody. So they're they're sending over support that helps me out, helps Zoe out, but then it also makes things fun for other people because they get to have the green name and the emotes and all that kind of stuff. Totally, it's a good addition. They had it on uh, they've had it on Twitch for years. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know, I don't know why it takes YouTube so long to add certain features. Um, probably just not top priority for uh, primarily video platform instead of streaming, I guess. Yeah, that's probably why. Oh, lagging big time now again. Nice. I'm thinking about maybe ch just checking out Kick a little bit too, see how that is, since that's a newer thing. It seems kind of interesting. I don't know if the MCOC community is over there, but... No, no, I wouldn't think so. I'd maybe try to do something else, but just oh, for... Oh, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. True. Checking it out, and I think playing music or that kind of stuff or whatever, I, don't, I think they haven't gotten to the point where they're... Oh god, oh god, okay, good. Cracking down on that stuff yet? No, I, I mean, that place doesn't seem like they're going to be cracking down on much. I think that's their whole thing, is they're trying to uh, skate on the... Uh... Yeah, but I mean, as as soon as they get big enough, they kind of have to. That's just how it works, unfortunately. But maybe I still I still blame Metallica. <laughs> They're like uh, backed by like you know casino gambling and stuff, so maybe they have enough money to. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> bribes. Uh, I don't read, know how that all works. But. Read Uncle K. BG just tested Kate and might be able to answer. What did Uncle K say? Hey, BG or chat, learning Kate Bishop, and when trying to stack debuffs, Cold Snap to Caltrops, the Cold Snap will fall off and be replaced with Caltrops. Sometimes they both fall off. Help? Well, like, can you, uh, you can't Penny, you can't AA Penny, right? She's poisoning me. Okay. She, I mean, you could bleed her, but that would just be take a while. Yeah. I'll watch again, but in the meantime, is anyone else seeing this? Uh, yeah, I mean, so... I don't know, Uncle K. We'll, we'll, we'll have to be a Brian question, because I did not watch um, the testing stream even, so... Ask me... Read it again, because I, I heard a little bit about Kate Bishop, but I was trying to figure out Penny first. Well, did, I mean, focus on your fight. No, nah, I mean, this fight, I know how to do this fight. I'm, I mess, okay. I'm gonna mess yeah. around with Hulk here a little bit, but otherwise... Okay. Uh, he said, hey, BG or chat, learning Kate Bishop and when trying to stack debuffs, cold snap to Caltrops, the cold snap will fall off and be 
faced with caltrops, sometimes they both fall off. Help. Um, so you I have to heavy attack her against the wall, and you, like you, you, you rotate around her arrows by double tapping the left side of the like screen. You know the block, whatever. Maybe you're doing that, and then you just gotta refresh them with. Um, Oh, that's right. Mighty charge. Oh, Penny, I hate your stinking guts. All right, well, I'm just going to go ham here and just see what, how much damage I can do. Eventually, she's going to auto block out of the stun, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah, mighty charge sucks for Hulk, oh, though. That's that. Rip. Yeah. All right, not worth using. Um, yeah, you got to you got to knock them down in the corner to refresh. And just watch the icon in the under your health bar to see which debuff you're going to be applying or passer or whatever you want to call it. Which which special arrow you're using. Um, and you could also like when you when you use a special it rotates it and you could use a pre fight to um, uh, lock it in place um, so it doesn't rotate yeah, when you use pick, a special at least. Yeah, just pick what just one. Question for BG, Abdo, or chat. Is Venom good for getting to Cav? I have one quest until Ultron, and I want to know from people that are good. Well, I thank you for including me in that. I was going to say, people you're asking good the wrong comment. People. I was like, yeah, well, I don't think that's very accurate, but okay. Uh, <laughs> um, is, he, is he good for getting to Cav? I mean, you can't think of any specific fights you need him for, for like buffs or bleed. Do you know? Because that it, Medusa fights afterwards, right? The Sentinel boss at the end is kind of a pain. You're not going to do much damage with him, but technically you could do that fight with anyone if you're just patient and don't mind having a thousand hit fight. Uh, otherwise, yeah, I mean, he's just like, he's an okay, just lane clearing sort of champion, but um, he's not going to like yeah. make it a total walk in the park for you if that's what you're after. Yeah. Bro, well, my stupid lions kicked me after all the wars were over, so I don't get any war or BG rewards. Is there anything I can do? Uh, Cyclone. Probably not. I don't know if it's going to work any differently this time because they're manually pushing out the rewards. Because, um, like, maybe they... Be, Depending on the timing of everything, you might have normally gotten those war rewards, but probably not. You can try sending in a ticket, support ticket, but usually if you're kicked, unfortunately, you're probably hosed on that. You're definitely hosed on the, the Battlegrounds rewards. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you were just hosed. I would, uh... Uh, I don't know if anyone else in here has any ideas, but I, I think you are just kind of yeah, screwed. Un unfortunately, that's I, I think, uh, usually the way it happens. I've seen I've seen maybe like them correct it for someone like Joke kicked someone and let them back into the alliance and not realizing. But mostly, I think you're pretty pretty screwed. I would uh, maybe put the alliance name out there just as a warning not to join people like that because that's a it's a crappy thing to do to someone. Yeah, I mean, you don't, you know, I don't, more circumstances, you never know exactly what's going on, but. True. Yeah. We have, uh, we have up front now just said to, if you don't hit the minimum for the battleground season in uh, four BG that uh, you're getting, you're getting booted before the rewards come out. So we don't want anybody leeching. Dang. Which pretty harsh but hey man people know it up front if they know it up front then they they know what they signed up for it's pretty hardcore yeah we're not having people put up a million points and then have someone be like well you know i saved i was waiting till the last two days and the mode game mode got taken like you get a whole month you get a, you get a month to do the the minimum so uh if you don't get there sorry but we last season was the final season where we were going to tolerate anybody leeching off the rest of us okay fair enough all right, um, all done. All right, that was the last path. It's about my normal time for this, right? Uh, yeah, about three, three hours, just a little over. It was pretty much good timing, yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. Um, 
So, about the final fight here, you guys. Uh, this might have to... Or the final, final quest might have to wait a little bit. Obviously, I don't want to wait too long. This is what I've been doing this for. Mm -hmm. um, but Battleground season is, is ending very soon. And I wanted to uh, play a bit more in here. Um, and then Abby Doe, not to throw you under the bus, I'm sorry for making people potentially hate you. Um, you're not going to be here one day and then like Wednesday and Thursday, I'm not going to have time to. So like it, it's, it's probably going to come down to Friday, um, for when I can hop back in there and, and finish up 8.2. So, uh, yeah, that's kind of what I'm looking at. Yeah. Is, is is probably Friday on that, you guys. Um, oh, I was Friday evening. Evening's not great for some people, depending on where they're at in the world. But for for North America, I mean, I can't think of what I'd rather do than come home from a hard day's work and an evening stream and watch Brian Grant beat the 8.2.6 Bahamut boss with a nice cool beverage in my hand. It sounds like a great time. If I could just get that message from Zuski, that's all I need. <laughs> Work week done, drink in hand. <laughs> oh, hopefully, hopefully. Uh, there was no warning or anything when I asked. They said it was because I missed one war where my phone was missing. Uh, well, I hate to say it, Cyclone, but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm missing a war. That. People do get kicked for that. Uh, they do. If you're if you're not if you're if you like couldn't communicate with them somehow because you didn't have your phone, so you couldn't tell them, "Hey guys, I'm sorry, but I don't have my phone." Then that kind of sucks. But it's unfortunate. Also, but he here's the thing: it's it's unfortunate that that happened. At the end of the day, it it's just some rewards that will be there, you know, next season. And um, yeah. That's honestly, I would probably just try not to let it uh, affect uh, your happiness. Uh, it sucks. It's de it definitely sucks. But um, yeah, it, it that's what happened. Like phone goes missing or whatever. Eh, at least you got a phone again. On the bright side. But yeah, missing <laughs> wars. Um, that kind of is grounds for 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 being kicked. Like, I think it's kind of a reasonable reason to, so. Um, if your alliance is, uh, has that as a requirement, at least. It's yeah. not optional. Well, that's what I say about being upfront about requirements and stuff. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think on that note, uh, I think I'm going to wrap it up here. Are you, you're streaming tonight, Abby Doe? Yeah, and I don't think I'm going to dinner with my dad this evening, so I'll probably be uh, back yeah. uh, around my normal-ish time, uh, about two hours from now. Um, I can pop a, a link, I guess, to the channel if anybody wants to. Oh, hey, Brian, already doing it. Thank you, sir. If anybody wants to come by, I... Yeah, I'll probably just lose more points in Battlegrounds tonight. <laughs> I mean, you already lost a bunch, you said, right? Maybe now I can get them back, or did you already gain them back? Oh, God. No, I just, it was, yesterday was not a good day, so. Uh, I'll, I'll, probably, I'll probably do some Battlegrounds tonight, try to get back oh, over 100 at least. We'll see. I'll probably do, like, one, because I want to, if I go for Danny, if I do that grind, uh, that's the other thing is, like, I don't know. If I, if I can get back to kind of where I was, I would really like to get to Quantum, but. I at least want to get up to Arcane so I can get those um, 2k 7 star shards, I think, and that's going to be at least 150, 160, 170 points, so it'll be an, an issue, you know? Yeah. Okay. Well, good luck with that. Uh, the link is in the uh, the chat for you guys that want to uh, check that out tonight. Uh, yeah, the thanks, Intoxicated sir. Intoxicated Gamer on YouTube here. And um, he's almost up to 2,000 subscribers, guys. 1.83K. Look at that. We're getting there. It's exciting. Yeah, it's pretty fun. How close are you to the next 7-star BG? Well, I'm there. But I'm kind of hoping Kabam updates the 7-star pool before the Titan pool thing. Uh, I, I don't know. It's looking more and more like they're not going to. But that just seems crazy to me. 
that the basic pool wouldn't be updated until October. So I'm going to hold out hope a little longer. And uh, well, yeah, we'll see. Um, mm. All right. And before I go to shout out to Rated P. Rated P? Question mark, question mark. <laughs> For being tonight's <laughs> biggest D. And uh, yeah, thank you to everyone else as well. Uh, how do I submit a ticket? If you if you want to submit a ticket, I'm not sure they can do anything, but uh, I think you do it from the is it the options yeah, on the home screen? Yeah, uh, you could back go to the options. I think menu. Yeah, go to the home screen and then the button in the top left corner the options. I think it's somewhere in there. Mm -hmm. Um. All right. Um. Uh, that note. Have a good night, everybody. Thank you uh, for tuning in. I'll see you guys Cheers, tomorrow. Chat.